All right, welcome everyone. Venus, thank you so much for the huge sub bomb. The 12th Dan, Legit Blind, Style Zactivane, Birdie, and Mac TX, congrats. Hold on, let me. I'll just. I don't need to do a whole. You know, let the music play. I'll just. We'll just start. We'll just start chat. <laughs> Good to see you, and thank you. Thank you, everyone, for joining. And uh, yeah, Tonza as well. Thank you for the support, Venus. Thank you so much for all the all the subs. Tess, good to see you. Welcome, welcome everyone. All right, we're doing just like plain old vanilla loper. Cheers. We're currently on about day twenty three. We're crafting uh, in the muskeg. Hey, legit blind. Good to see you. Thanks for uh, showing your support and. Uh, Appreciation of Venus, that's nice. Northern Lights, welcome in. Uh, all right, all right. What, what's going on? Yeah, we're crafting the moose satchel, I think. Wolf coat and a bow. We just made some deer stuff, and we've got the um, overpowered craft station. Hold on, I got this hair, like, in the corner of my eye. Okay, I got it. It's gone. Uh, we have the craft station that is at <clears throat> the workbench with the snow shelter, so... It's pretty, it's pretty silly. It's pretty silly. Okay, we got a bear. Oh, we killed a bear. Which bear was this? Which which bear did we kill, chat? Oh, it must have been, yeah, it was the uh, bear in Broken Railroad. Oh, look at this. A couple sh chaplains as well. Let's put those here so we can actually see them. Put the bow away, Astrid. Okay, we got the bear hide, we got the saplings, what else is going on? Days survived 23, okay. Bunkers... Let's add FM here. We're just trying to keep track of this because we, we want the peppers pie, right? We gotta get that recipe. Saplings, yeah. Did you get a catch last stream? Yeah, today uh, we'll just be picking up where we left off, but I hope the move went well, or is going well. Dang, you're moving today? Oh my goodness, well, I hope it goes well. Moving's always like one of the big stressors in life, so I hope you were organized and things go smooth. That's like the biggest part is like making sure stuff's somewhat organized. Like I know when I move, it's like, all right, here's a box. The stuff just goes inside the box. But like what you could do is, you know, put things from the kitchen in the box and then write kitchen on the box makes things so much easier. I'm sure you've done all this, but just for those out there who've never moved before, it's 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 a lot. <laughs> hey, Calgarian Mike, good to see you. Welcome. Okay, the notes. Forge has stuff in the bin. Hammer. Acorn. Sewing kit. Okay, we have... I think we have wolf hides on us, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, yeah, this is it. We need... We also... Maple. I thought there was a maple here. We, we should have a maple somewhere down. That's what we need, too. Okay, day count. When did our moose go down? <laughs> We're never gonna get this chat. Um, Mystery Lake to the Muskeg. Okay, so we, we we forged here, and then we basically shot the moose somewhere around here. 
15, I'd say. So... I don't know, we're almost there, I think. Maples with the moose? Yeah, I'm pretty sure we left the maple in the moose cave. The 12, 10 or 12 guts, too. Okay. Moving is less stressful than staying where I was. <laughs> good outlook, yeah, good outlook. Okay, hold on. Let's say it's here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 days. I don't know. Oh, good, we do have some meat. Oh wow, it takes 10 years to pick it up if you have your bow out. This pack is getting too heavy to carry. Okay, let's let's go to our craft station and then we'll... Hey, thank you for the support. We got the hype level 2. Amazing. Got a blizzard, so we might as well uh, do some crafting. Full music stereo. Ups. <gasps> oh shoot. This wolf always, always with this wolf. He's always there. Don't sprain your wrist now, Astrid. You going to single family house? Oh, that's awesome. Nice work. We can't even see where we are, Chet. Where's the homestead? I don't even know where I am. Where the heck am I? Okay, there, wow. We we came down like before and usually we come out around the other side, I guess. Uh, I know we talked about getting fuel situated. Did we do that? Did we get fuel? <gasps> It's the first time I've ever found this here. This is so doofy looking. What the is this? That's the hacksaw swan now. What the heck? Oh good, we have lots of meat. This is this is amazing. like sticks right here. Let's just grab these. Yoink. Hey, Vita, welcome in. Rice milk, welcome, welcome. Three years of foliage. Holy smokes. Nice work. All right. Uh, workbench, we're warm, wolf skin coat. Only 32 hours. Holy. Oh, we didn't even drink acid. What were you thinking? Like night is coming. Yeah, night is coming, but we'll we'll do this as long as we can. But yeah, I hope everyone's doing good. I hope everyone's weekend is off to a great start. I know we're early at it. Well, depending on where you are, but my weekend started like two minutes ago. So cheers. So we can craft here as long as it's <clears throat> clear skies at night. So this is another reason why this spot is so strong, is because we can craft at night as long as it's clear. Like if there's a blizzard or fog, no, but as long as there's good weather, we're, we're, we're laughing. We can put in the time. And like, I have so much coffee. I could, I could like craft four hours, drink a coffee, craft four hours, drink a coffee. Like we could, we could just, power through this whole sesh. I know everyone loves crafting, so that's why I just try to, we try to just go for it. <laughs> we try to go for it. Normally when I craft, I like to have some sort of weird situation going. Like for example, when I'm at Coastal Highway, I like to craft in Quonset and then sleep in the truck. 
to mitigate cabin fever. Like, it's very important to me to mitigate cabin fever. It's like my the only thing I think about in this game consistently. Cabin fever, just can't do it. Hey, hey Rox, you're here early. Nice work. Good to see you. Hope your week went well. <sighs> Dang, we're crafting, chat. Oh, I had a dream last night. I found a mag lens in my dream. Isn't that weird? I don't have a mag lens yet. Damn. Let's see if there's any deer. Deer spawned in. All right. Just some worn frozen jeans laying on the ground. You know what, we do we do need to make the fire, so let's just go for it. Boop. Alarm clock, it got the it got the notifications popping off. Alright. What are we doing? Yeah, we do have to go grab the, the moose hide at some point. I think that's done now and the guts, but we'll get the wolf coat and then we'll yeah, do do a walk, maybe get some deer if we need it i doubt it though or wait we I'll have a whole moose right we have a whole moose chat that we killed we just eat that you know what we could do too so we've got two hours here let's get water just go with the quick cook pot i'm not sure i can carry much more Sort by weight, 41 minutes. Okay, so we can grab uh, this, that, and the other thing here. Oh, we should grab the hammer for this. That'd be smart. Oh, well, it's fine. It's all, all we're really doing is just making a little snack. 40 minutes, okay. Good stuff, good stuff. I take forever to fall, people, so probably watch Juan's regular. Yeah, no worries, no worries. <laughs> Bonjour from Quebec. Bonjour from Vancouver Island. Comment ça va? Ça va bien. Et toi? My French is poor. J'ai parlé français un petit peu. <laughs> Sorry, that's 12 years of Canadian French in school. That's what that gets you. Not bad. That's not bad. Oh my goodness. <laughs> One time I went to France and I tried to use my French to order an orange juice. And I just literally said in French, I'd like an orange juice, you know, like jus d'orange. I said jus d'orange. And the guy looked at me like I was insane and he had no idea what I was talking about. I think he handed me a coffee and I paid for it and left. Yeah, and also, like, I went, I was in the UK, and my, um, my cousin was there with me, and I had to go to the post office in France in some, like, small village, and I was like, oh, it's fine, I'll just, I'll go there, and, and, like, all I need to do is change money, so I was like, so I'll explain in French that I need to exchange some money, and I tried, and they were like, what? Huh? So I had to get my cousin, who's from the UK, who barely speaks French, but spoke it better than me, to translate. <laughs> yeah. Anyways. Anyways, 20 minutes. Okay, let's just grab some planks in the meantime. Plank action. No, oh, now we're good. Okay, 19. All right, all right. A bit more plank. We're wasting time, but at least we're multitasking with the um, fuel. Okay, 220. Okay, let's get like one more lump of wood on this, and then we have some here for next time. It's almost like we know what we're doing, chat. 19 minutes? Okay, we'll do 19 minutes of our coat. Forty-three to 
93. Nice. See, we're getting tired, but only just, and we're almost done the coat. Oh, four hours? That's not gonna work once. That's not gonna do it. Hey, my hand, good morning, good to see you. Welcome in. Hope your week's gone well. Okay, what are we doing? Should we sleep? Nah, we could drink a coffee. Drink some coffee. Well, how much, how much do we have? Do we want to be wasting it? 5, 10, 13, 15 cups of coffee on us. Hey, hydrate. Cheers. I'm hydrating with my smoothie that I've still got to drink. It's like my breast breakfast. My breast fisks? No, that's not that word. Twins here too. Nice. Down some Cheerios. <clears throat> I just watched a cereal tier list on the YouTubes. <laughs> it was pretty funny. But it, it was a little hit of nostalgia. I used to have Honey Nut Cheerios when I was a kid. But like, thinking about it, I got some sweet cereal. My mom would let me pick once in a while, and I'd always get the, uh... Oh jeez, what are they called? Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Cinnamon Toast Crunch, that was my cereal. When I was allowed to pick my own. Probably like, 18 cups of sugar in one bowl of cereal. <laughs> But yeah, I did. Uh, I did get in some Honey Nut Cheerios for sure. All right, I think we're like okay on the meat. I don't know if I want to cook it all. Ah, why not? Let's do two more pieces. Two more pieces, and then let the fire go out. Five liters of water. That's enough for what we're doing here. Hopefully. Oh, you know what, let's repair this first. It's one stick, I think. Two sticks. Okay, 90% one stick, 80% two, and under 80, then you have to use cloth. So you, you do want to repair it pretty quickly. Don't want to let it go too long. And if, and if, you, if you folks haven't seen this before, this is an original Accurize 2 workarounds that I found out about like seven years ago I think and you can basically craft through the snow shelter at several locations as long as there's an outdoor workbench where you can put a whatchamacallit a snow shelter beside it you're good to go there you go there's another there's a video of where to do it here but there's there's a few others where it's pretty straightforward you don't even have to worry really fussle fussle fuss about it you're doing well. Well, that's good to hear, Triz. That's good to hear. Yeah, Coastal Highway, all you have to do is, like, break up the pallet that's near the um, workbench, and then you'll just have all the room in the world. All this cost us was one coffee, chat. I'd lie down right here. I thought I'd ever wake up again. I'm going for it. Boom, wolf coat. Look at this. Eight, okay, what's the what's the previous temp? 28, 28, 27, 80 versus 22, 10, 36, 67? What? 22, it's warmer, right? Yes, we, we just got like four degrees with the wind chill. Oh, that's so that's that's good. That's good stuff. Oh, okay, that's why it's in there. It doesn't fit. Uh, here, let's take the clothing and put it in this drawer. Just jam it in there. Mouth so dry. We're still rocking the decent fleece mittens. Oof. Yeah, it hurts to sprint, but we kind of know that's what we're getting into now with the crafted clothing. The boots, the deer pants, the coat. It all hurts. Okay, what else can we dump? Mm. You know what, we should do some like sharpening. Sharpen our knife up.
All right, that worked. Now we can go do the satchel tomorrow, maybe. I'm not sure I can carry much. I'll just, I'll just do like a couple, couple sharpen sessions, cause we'll forget otherwise. Yeah, like late game, you don't need to sprint. We're, we're, we're basically a walking tank. We don't need to, we don't need to move fast. That's the philosophy. I know it's like a prof's philosophy is, why do you need to run if you're like got a hundred percent defense? <laughs> <clears throat> I just want to get this into better shape, otherwise we'll forget about it. Oh, and it's morning now. Okay, let's go ahead and like sleep five hours, and then we'll go get the moose satchel. Yeah, this is good. And then we can craft more with the bow. And maybe we sleep longer. Or craft. We got a lot of acorns. We could we could smash these up, I think. Make flour. Powdered ribs, yeah. Like walking around with good defense is not a bad thing for sure. Oh. I think we have like 20 arrows or something ridiculous like that. We could drop off our wires, but we don't scrap. Whoops. Let's just leave them here. Forget about that. Oh, uh, you know what? I think we have acorns over here. Can't repair it? Oh, Astrid. Have this quick repair, and then we'll rush on over and grab our moose meat slash hides and stuff. Actually, you know what? We should shed weight because that that hide is five kilos, isn't it? There's only 10 kilos in this thing? What is going on? Yeah, alright, alright. What? Ah, oh, this game sometimes. Just let me shove all my acorns in here. Like a, like, like a squirrel. Why do I have four rose hips? How does, how does that happen? All right, now we're light and lethal. Let's roll. Toolboxes hold so much more than 10 kilos. Yeah, exactly. It's like it hits one hammer and a couple cans. No, no, it's the charcoal too. I have like 15 charcoal. I should just dump that somewhere else. All right, I'm trying to think what else 
Well, yeah, we could probably go and grab some scrap metal to repair the... What should we call it? But we haven't got the transponder yet. And... I don't know. We, we could do that next. That's like a maybe. Maybe. Maybe that's the next step. Is this the nice? But yes. Part of it at least. I don't know. So we do have plenty of food. And that moose is there. Oh, a burdock. Yoink. kill all the wolves in the path because they'll give me problems otherwise. Oh, they're flanking me. Okay, that's one. That other one will probably, like, come back sooner or later. Where'd he go? See, we'll run into him on the way back when we're exhausted, so we might want to sleep. <laughs> oh well. Oh well. Yeah, there he is. Sneaky devil. This is our cave here. We could always go just quickly rip over to the bleak inlet transition for some coal. I don't know if we need it. Now that we're like all warm, we probably don't need a bunch of coal on us. Walk around with like two coal and we'll be fine. We just have to take note that there's a lot of random junk at that forge. Okay. Yeah, we're um we're warm. Feels like six degrees. Twenty two ten, so we're feeling thirty two. Thirty two with the wind chill blown us. Which is crazy. Hey, is this all rancid? Rancid? Okay, we could cook that. Cured, cured, good. Oh wow, here we go. Alright, we got everything. Oh, and the tea we remembered is here. It's it's still hot. So the like the tea hack still works? I thought it didn't. Oh no, it's not hot. It says warm, but it's not. Do we want to? I don't really want to. Let's just walk back. We'll be fine. We'll just shoot that wolf in the face. Maybe we should think about... Mm, I guess what we could do is repair the work gloves we have. Because we have leather boots now we can destroy. Repair those work gloves and then upgrade from the mittens. Like, I don't know if I want rabbit mitts. They are good, but you just have to repair them so often. Like, the, the rabbit hat I don't really worry about anymore because you can find, you know, the aviator hat's good and then the balclava's good. So, the rabbit hat's not as necessary. But now that I heard the, uh, oh no, the leather jacket might not be on Interloper, that makes me sad. This, the flight jacket.
grab a mitts would be nice. I feel like we have the fixings at um, maybe mountain, mountain town? No, um, camp, no. Mm, the Carter Dam. I think Carter Dam has them. I think we left a bunch of rabbits there, but I'm not sure. Hey, Zer, welcome in. Good to see you. I think the rabbit mitts are definitely an upgrade, but we'll see. We'll see. I'm just, I don't, I don't know. I don't waste time with the rabbits. And usually early game, I was, there was that thing where you couldn't harvest them, maybe, if you didn't have a tool. All right, that will start a problem. Let's just hustle out. Yeah, the problem is repairing them, and for traveling, you don't have like cured rabbit hides laying around all over the place, so. Ow. Oh, I'll also take note of the bear hide that's here, so we don't forget about it. Aw, oh, nuts. Will he, f will he attack me here? Yep. That's cool. He definitely attacked me. <laughs> Slow and steady. Don't worry. We've got this five kilo moose satchel that's going to turn into a backpack, so it'll all work out. Yeah, I'm definitely not making the moose coat. It's just not necessary at this point. If we need a better coat, we'll get the uh, bear coat going. All right, anytime. All right, there we are. Good. We can probably finish this before we need to sleep tonight. Let's go. Okay, we'll drink, we'll craft. All right, let's go. <clears throat> Moose, satchel, bow, and then we're good. I think that's it for crafting for a while. 10 hours, I thought it was five. Ouch. All right. It's foggy, so we might not get the session at night. Just fine, we'll just sleep. It's dusk, so I can't be far behind. Yeah, the weather looks like it's not going to be a, a crafting night. We can try. I'm so tired. I can't right here. Go, Astrid, go. Have like random stuff everywhere. Hey, hey fisherman, good to see you. Welcome in. Yeah, it's been good. Um, my kid just had their six month checkup and they're at 60% weight, 87% length or height. So that's that's good. <laughs> they're doing all the, the things babies are supposed to do but yeah no it's been good other than being like tired all the time and exhausted i'm i'm enjoying it <laughs> but i think that's you gotta expect the being tired and exhausted part that's just that's just how it goes all right look at that carry capacity jumping up 15 it's so good sure footing expired but that's fine we don't need that hey tim welcome in good to see you Taking the exhaustion damage, taking every damage. Looks like I survived another night. 
Wait, do we have the second bow now? Oops. I meant to craft it to 99, but it's fine. It's fine. Okay, let's go ahead and sleep now. Astrid deserves it. Eight cured gut. Okay. Wow. Okay. Let's get some sleep. Even if it's just a little bit. You get to your 20s and you're still tired? Oh, don't tell me that. Don't tell me that. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's okay. I'm, I'm getting used to it. I just feel like, you know, there's a bit of a cloud of confusion over me. You know, a little foggy in the head a little bit. Okay, what are we doing? Let's go ahead and actually get, get some rest for Astrid. And then I, th I think that's everything, right? Bow, we have the bow, we have the moose satchel, we have the wolf coat, we have the deer pants, boots. We got it all, chat. We did it all. Bear of bad news, no, it's fine, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, can, you, can we access the drawer from here? We have one bandage? That's it? Astrid. Okay, I know what we're doing. I know what we're doing. Let's process some cloth. And then we'll repair. But we'll, we'll, we'll sleep first. We do need to sleep. Let's give, let's give Astrid a few, a few good hours. Cats don't buy home. Let's just take them over. Yeah. <laughs> well said. Okay, okay, we got a whole list of things we want to do. So let's tear up the boots. I hate to do this because they're they're good boots, but we get the two scrap from it. Two scrap, two leather. And then we attempt to repair our gloves that are frozen. I hope that doesn't affect our repair quality. No, and then we repair again. To get them half, half, actually halfway decent? Yes, 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 yes. Good. Okay, and now... They are frozen solid. Sweet. So we have them ready. Let's just get some more cloth. Make some bandages. Go to sleep. <laughs> Kids moved out. The cat just took over. That's funny. Almost there. Almost there, chat. Okay. We're just tearing- uh, all this clothing got frozen in that container. That's kind of good to know, because I'm assuming that ruins it faster than it being, like, inside stored safely. Okay, so we have the crampons. Bonus. Mm, we don't- do we want all of this stuff? Oh my goodness. Your parents are moving! Oh no! Five hours. Wow. Are they moving out of province? It's tough when your kids leave when they make choices you'd rather they not make with their lives. Yeah. But just know that I'm sure, you know, some lessons do need to be learned. That's just kind of how it goes. Okay, we do have a little cloth now. Oh, bandages, right. There was a reason for the cloth. It's a 10-hour drive to Alberta. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. That's right. You're still on the West Coast, after all. The interior, nice. That's cool, that's cool. Okay, I think I do want to see my cattail stack in my pocket here. Actually, let's go ahead and do this. Let's dump all of this junk. We're doing it now, chat. We're organizing our loot. OK, 
Okay, the charcoal can go right here. Mmm, coffee. Nice one. I actually do have coffee, but it's not been tapped into yet. I've got my smoothie. I'm slow playing. Okay, charcoal. I'm, I'm like so out of it, chat. I'm, I'm like, what are we doing? Two seconds ago, I declared what we were doing. All right, I think now we feed Astrid, we sleep, and then we leave here. We leave here victorious, having conquered the muskeg. Yeah, I got my smoothie still. All right, it's gone. Done. You're gonna lurk? All right, thanks. Hope you're doing well, fish. Hope, uh... You're like, I feel like you're almost retired, right? It's been... it's been close to... that time, right? You're creeping, you're creeping towards it. Either way, I hope you're doing well, and thanks for popping in. Always nice seeing you. Okay. Sleep time? Yeah, let's sleep here. One final good sleep in this shelter. We go 10 hours, we're not even worried. Snow shelter living. It's 17 plus 7.5 in our bedroll. That's what it feels like. You retire in two years. Okay. Four years live, wow. Four years. It's amazing. Well, congrats, keep it up. And uh, two years, that's not long at all. That's not long at all. Okay. Now what, chat? Now where do we go? We have our second pair of underwear, so we don't need to go to Hush River. What? These are still frozen? How do we unfreeze these? What? I gotta put them down by a fire or something. Interesting. Almost four years, wow. Yeah, four years is a long time. Long time. Okay, we're underweight by five kilos, chat. That's good. We have a hundred cattails. Let's drop like 50 off in here. Yeah, 50 cattails. 36 kilos. Wait, do we have fire start three? We don't, do we? Oh. That's so sad. Didn't I have a whack of Okay, I do have 14 still. I mean, we're pretty we're pretty decked out. Let's just chill here for a bit, no puns intended, and get uh, get our stuff sharpened before we leave. Gotta go. All right, take care. Hope your move goes smooth, and thanks again for all the support. All right, cheers. I got some coffee now. The good stuff. Hmm. What do you think, chat? Do we go to the airfield? Do we go to Hush River? Go to Bleak Inlet? Do we go to oh, beachcombing? Oh my goodness! I think we go beachcombing. Can we go to? Can we just go play in Coastal Highway? <laughs> do we need to get the transponder? Like I feel like we should probably get the transponder. Chat, what do you think? Airfield for the radio, or do we just go mess around in Coastal Highway? Desolation Point, beachcombing, and, and maybe fishing a bit. You decide, chat. I'm pretty easy. Pretty easy. I, I honestly thought, like, if we had these frozen gloves on our person, they would de-thaw overnight. <laughs> Am I crazy? I, 
I wouldn't I wouldn't mind beachcombing. I think it'd be fun. We'll just like maybe head in that direction and not really, really worry about the transponder mission since we just did it last time. Bring our tools. We we should probably bring our feathers too. And you know what? We'll we'll make We'll make some shafts first. Make some arrow shafts. That way we we're we're wa working we're working with a few on the road if we need. De thaw and it's Oh right. I would everyone always gives me heck about that, but yeah, I always say uh the wrong thing, don't I? Thaw. De thaw would be to freeze. It's like the thaw is a thing, and to de thaw would be the antithesis of the thing. Antithesis? 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 Why is that so hard for me to say? The opposite? I don't know. I'm struggling, chat. I'm struggling. Alright. I need more coffee. Obviously. Okay. Let's get another couple hours and then we go to the other side of the map. And why don't we just bring, just in case, a couple guts with us. Yeah. Yeah, okay, what else? I feel like we're missing something. What am I forgetting? The hammer? The acorn powder flower? No, like, we'll just note that all of this is here. FM is basically our main base. Hammer, acorns, times like 30. Sewing kits, other odds and ends, bunch of cans. I need to really clarify. Deer hide four, meat guts, no. No, no, bunker has bear hide. Uh, guts at forge too. Many, many supplies. Supplies? Supplies? All right. This cave now has nothing. Oh, this cave, no, the cave near Bleak has lots of moose meat. Notes chat, they're important. Let's see what we got in um, Mystery Lake. Oh, the dam is unlooted. Does that mean we don't have a bunch of rabbit hides? Oh, okay, there's there's stuff at Timberwolf Mountain. Cave near engine has six birch to gut rabbit. No, that can't be right. This isn't up to this isn't up to date. My notes are trash. This is the problem. I take notes and then I don't update them when I like retrieve the stuff. So I'm looking at my Timberwolf Mountain notes and I know I know they're wrong. I know they're not right. It's awful. Hey, Sir Loin, welcome in. It's been a minute. Hope you're well. Hope you're doing great. We're just here. We just got this character all tittled up. We're decked out. We're ready to rock. Ooh, why don't we take the uh, interior and maybe we see the bear. If we get a second bear, then we can leave that hide here and then there's a bear coat. Uh, yeah, not a bad idea. Or if the bear is on the other side by Poacher's Camp, we just kill that bear and leave the hide in the cave on our way out. That sewing kit may be broken. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure. I'm sure the notes. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we grabbed the sewing kit that was there. So that's not a thing anymore. We need to make some fires and get our fire start skill up. done that. Okay, where's the bear? I do not see him anywhere. Oh, you know what? We should have torn down the snow shelter. It's fine. It's fine. If we come back, it will be there. Well, I... Okay, so... I'm pretty sure I left the stuff by the engine, but then I grabbed it and I brought it back to the hut. So I think all that stuff is actually either out of there or I put it at the mountaineer's hut. So like, 
the notes are okay. Like, you know, like the stuff like the curing saplings, I grabbed all that and I, I walked out of the map with it. I think. I don't remember. It's so long ago. But we could grab a bunch more cattails too if we wanted. Yeah, I mean, why not? There's lots over here. Why not? Why shouldn't we have 70 cattails? We don't have any meat on us, so... It's nice to have a bunch of cattails so you don't have to worry about hunting, losing well-fed and stuff. Yesterday's temp was 16? On my, um, like, work laptop it has a temp and it's at 11, so you must be getting getting a bit warmer than where I'm at. That's, I did hear, though, Rox, that it's supposed to get up to, like, 20 next week. Uh, so there you go. I think, I think yeah, spring's here. All the, uh, all, like, the cherry blossoms have come and gone. The, you know, the spring flowers are out. There's a few walks in my neighborhood I go on and there's, like, a wild... I guess they're crocuses or snowdrops or whatever you call them. They're they're out in full force now. Go back to look for the lamp. <laughs> we should, but I probably won't do that right away. But yeah, the lamp. The thing with the lamp is we walked to where it should have been, but we didn't find it. Like we definitely went through most of those caves. The only one that we didn't do was, I think, apparently the cave between Keepers North and South is an actual spawn as well. So we didn't go there. I love lamp, yeah. We have... We have the other lamp, so we're okay. We're doing just fine. See if we can get eyes on that bear before we get too close so we can kind of plan what we're doing. The other thing oh, is a wolf. I don't really like him. Yeah, he's seen me. He's seen me, chat. Run. Um, I don't like about the bears on this map is they are like possible to die on the thin ice where you actually lose everything because you can't even get there to like harvest it or grab your arrows. So if the bear doesn't die to a critical hit, it can just run off and die on thin ice, which I think is lame. It's happened to me before. Hey, mini waves, good to see it. I am well, thank you. I have a full weekend planned, but looking forward to it. Why is, why is he scared? Oh, why did I do that? No! Oh! My arrow chat! Wait a second. Well, didn't I just shoot two more at him? Where do those go? Uh-oh. What happened to my arrows, chat? Why would I do that? Why would I do that? Okay, let's retrace our steps. So we shot him... And then he ran this way. Did, does anyone know?
taking ill advised shots. Yeah, I just, I was tempted. I was tempted. I mean, I got the first hit. Then I immediately had regrets. <laughs> Oh, okay, one. Okay, so there's one more, I think. I think it's around here somewhere. idea where this arrow went. You pick up the first miss, now the second one? Oh, thank you. Yeah, that makes sense. I have 18, 19. Yeah, I think, I think that's right. You're right, you're right. Okay, all right. So we do have a lost arrow, unless we can find that wolf carcass. Dang. We're never gonna find that arrow. Thank you, good, good, good math, good math. That's what chat's for, keeping track of my lost arrows. Definitely, definitely helpful. this already, I'm pretty sure we have. <gasps> oh, there he is, okay. Just warm up a bit, maybe. See if that wolf dies. Thin wool sweater. Wolf killed 22. Let's get the hour. Okay, maybe he's already dead. Darn. Twenty two, okay. Oh wow, the bear's way over there now. Blizzard. I mean, if the bears or the wolf's dead, then we could try to find it. Is that it right there? No. <sighs> We're never gonna find this wolf. Let's not get lost on the marsh during a blizzard, please and thank you. Alrighty. Alrighty then, let's get uh, some sticks maybe?
be nice if we had a bit of meat to cook, but it's fine. Hey, Elephant Shoes, thank you for the 25 Come on, months. That's Come amazing. On. Thank you, thank you. Hope you're doing well. Cheers. Over two years of support. That's that's crazy. Thank you, thank you. Hmm. Good coffee today. Is is the blizzard noise a little loud, chat? I'm I'm having hot, trouble thinking. <laughs> Let me know. I can turn it down. Oh, it said failed, but I saw the flames. I saw the flames, chat. I saw them. Whoops. It's fine, we have a thousand matches. Yeah, for those just tuning in, we're basically just doing vanilla, vanilla loper. Fail, 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 fail. It's fine, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. This is the one. Perfect. I would drink almost anything. Oh, now. I got you, Aster. We we drinking water. here because we just crossed from the forge so it's like we were in the middle of the marsh a minute ago but yeah at least i know where i am now we almost got lost out there looking around for the bear i think yeah it's what kind of lichen tea is always, always nice. Let's not forget, we do have the thermos. Fill with coffees or something. And what do we got to eat? Crackers and cattails. We have four kilos of these. So that's what we do. Some part of me always loves when it's a blizzard because I know there won't be another one for a few days. Yeah, except for a few maps now, like uh, like right for sick and airfield and Pleasant Valley. Yeah, like if you're in a blizzard and you're somewhere cozy, it's awesome. I remember like early game when I was first learning how to play, and it'd be like coastal highway at fishing camp, and I'd literally just be like inside one of the cabins, being like, oh, this is the best. I'm so happy here. There's a blizzard outside and I'm warm. <laughs> and I was like, I'm winning. I just beat the long dark. Why would I ever leave this cabin? All right, we're full. We're full of it now. Oh shoot, it's not burn our tea. Let's give an hour, see what happens. For those wondering, we were on our way to Coastal Highway, but we got interrupted.
All right, the bear would have despawned and then respawned, I think. But at this point, I probably won't be able to see him even if I wanted to. Oh. Is that a bear or a stump? Yeah, there he is. Okay, he's over here. It's a bit off the trail, but we can always get him on the way out. Now we're talking bear or stump. Yeah, bear stump. When I used to actually hunt, that happened all the time. We'd like stop, stop and be like, what is that? Take a closer look. Yep, it's just a burnt stump. Looks like a bear's butt. Okay, yeah, we leave, uh, we leave it. Yeah, we don't need a hot bev. We're fine. We're fine. We're losing that arrow though, chat. Maybe we take note of this. FM. One lost arrow in a wolf. Yep, we'll remember. Alright, I, I haven't done this build like with the wolf coat in a long time, but wolf coat Mackinac isn't bad. Day 50, it might start to get a little cold, but now that we have the option for the improvised wrap with the down bedroll, I mean, it doesn't really matter what we do. We can just slap two improvised wraps on and have six warmth. But then it costs us our satchel. Okay, I didn't even see the bear now. Oh yeah, there he is. Okay, oh wow. I mean, he's coming this way, but it's gonna be too long. Let's just get the mystery lake bear. That's that's easy. Easy bear. Hmm. Or, you know what? Even better idea, since we're going a coastal highway. We can either grab a hide in the way or just get two bears and coastal down. It's easy. Yeah, we still got plenty of sprint. It's plenty of sprint. Yeah, it's been ages since I've done a proper beachcomb session in Coastal Highway. So we'll travel. Yeah, the only thing I need is these to not be frozen anymore. <laughs> I should have dropped them at the fire, was I thinking? Alright. That was a that was a good muskeg session. We got our moose, all the meat we could ever want wolves for the coat and then we managed to craft everything outside we did lose an arrow though so it did cost us dearly i just want to check what i think we left a bunch of food at camp office maybe Ooh, aurora night maybe look at this Blizzard stopping, the sky's purple all of a sudden. It's a little concerning. What do they say? Pink skies at night, Aurora delight? Why are wool gubs so rare on low prayer? I They're not supposed to be on low prayer faceless. There was a glitch where they appeared in a backpack in Broken Railroad for a long time on interloper. So people could have interloper runs with these wool gloves, but they're, they're not meant to be on interloper. 
It's kind of like how the climbing socks aren't supposed to be on Inchiloper, but they also are on Inchiloper. But yeah, the uh, the actual wool gloves aren't aren't in the game anymore. They patched that out. There was a bunch of stalker loot that ended up on Interloper after one of the patches, and I'm talking like fisherman sweater, couch and sweater, uh, red wool underwear, um, work pants. All that stalker loot was on. Oh wait, what? Why are wool gloves so rare on Loper? No, no, wool gloves aren't supposed to be on Loper. Yeah, wool socks are very common. Climbing socks are rare on Interloper, but they do exist, but um, the wool gloves don't don't exist anymore. They patched them out. But yeah, there was, a, there was a, a period where a lot of the stalker loot was ending up on Interloper, and including those wool gloves. So I have a couple files with them, I think, but not, not that I've played in a while. I had a bunch of like no goa runs too, no nope runs where I had like stupid good clothes from those illegal loot stashes. Mm, you know what? We might grab some tarm again if they're here. I'm freezing. Just because I am out of feathers, I think. Hey, Tina, good to see you. Welcome in. Hope you're well. Tina's last stream in TLD, folks. If you're not following Tina, go over, drop a follow. You won't regret it. Yeah, we're just um, playing the vanilla interloper. Chill, chill vibes. No drama, hopefully. I think there's a spawn for Charming in here. Maybe not. Yeah, yeah, I see. I think I see. Is that one? Oh no, oh I scared one I think. Okay, I see them. There's three. Four. Oh, that one ran? Oh no. Oh no. Alright, so three out of four, not bad. All right, now we got 10 hours of labor ahead of us. No problemo. Minecraft, what are you set as? Make broth, chat. We can finally make broth. Let's go, polite Canadian. <laughs> Yeah, let's go make some broth, maybe. I don't know. Great shooting, thank you. I thought... I think it's with the fire-hardened arrows. Like, it won't scare the other birds. But yeah, we definitely scared that one that was there. Beside. It took me a while, because I was aiming high. You know, like, sometimes when you're further away, you, like, aim above. But with the tarming, you have to aim, like, straight on. It seems. These are all... Yeah, this is this is a good plan. We do need it. Do we have fuel, though? Oops. Oh, look at this. We got food, chat. Search? We haven't even looted this place? What the heck, ones? I'm not sure I'm carrying much more. We've literally not even looted this place. I'm sure I, ha I have been in here before. Maybe my mag lens is here. Ooh. Oh! Let's freaking go, chat. 99%! <laughs> Boom. Oh, that's so good. Okay, I'm, I'm very glad. Get your hype, hype, hype. Yeah, we definitely were in here because look, we, we looted the kitchen and left everything there, but we didn't even open the filing cabinet. Wow. Wow. Don't worry, I'm, I'm embarrassed, I'm ashamed. All of those things. Yep, meant to do that. 
What else have we missed, Astrid? Potatoes. Yep, potatoes everywhere. All right, I'll, I'll forgive ourselves. You know, we can't win them all. I'll take it. All right, we got our May ones. We got our May ones. I'm gonna read that book because we're so bad at fire starting. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. I know, waste another match, but. Okay, now we can go back to what we were planning. Oh, we can actually grab this double broth. Why am I making broth? I don't even need it. I don't need broth right now. What am I doing? Let's just cook the food and eat it. I'm sorry, chat, I'm all over the place. figure this out. We do have lots of water, so we could potentially make broth, right? Yeah, we could. Level one. So it's a kilo of ptarmigan, a half, a, a liter and a half of water, and one pinch of salt. All right, let's do one. Forty minutes already. Ooh, I gotta be careful or I'm gonna accidentally grab the meat. Drop the gloves. Yeah, you're right. I gotta drop the gloves and cure them? No. He thaw them. Thaw them. Hey, Nav, good to see you. Welcome in. You know, I'll drop the gloves and then I'll forget to pick them up. of water. Okay, let's just cook some of this. Don't let Wands forget the gloves. Oh, I'll, I'll see them immediately when I walk out with my bow two days from now and go, hey, where are my gloves? Okay, fresh charming and cooked. We'll have like one broth, it's fine. I gotta go check out my cat in a minute. I gotta clean my smoothie mug anyways. Hey, at least we, the ptarmigan are like pretty decent. Oh, why did I pick that? Why did I do that? Oh, Astrid. Oh, you silly goose. Uh, dang. Okay, are there any more crates to pull? I guess we have a... Darn. Yeah, we'll tear up the torch. Working on trimming dogs for? Oh my. Do you have a really shaky dog? 540, 49. This is gonna be our whole night is harvesting these. Uh oh, is it burning? Eight minutes till burns. Oh, it was a tiny little slice. Whoops. 
Five minutes already, 10 minutes, seven minutes, nine minutes, 14% wet. I'm gonna grab him now. Okay, then we'll sleep, read our book and carry on. Ooh, I hear a wolf or something outside. Clawing around. Okay, so we have broth. 782 calories? What? Is that right? That seems a, like a lot. Where it gets along and gets in you know, the clippers, just walks away from you. Yeah, it's like when I try to uh, brush my cat, I gotta make a hole. You know, I gotta like put him in an area he can't run away. I gotta give him lots of treats. Can't take too long. I, I think I've not made enough broth, but there's all sorts of weird broth stuff going on, and I have no idea. And it's morning. Carcass expert after that, of course. Naturally. Okay, let's go ahead and sleep a little. <sighs> Potato. We'll put that downstairs. Do we need to sleep? Yeah, let's get like three hours. That's enough. And then I'm gonna break quick. I'll be back in like um, two minutes. I'm just gonna go rinse my mug out. So enjoy some random clips. I'll see you shortly. Whew. Breathe, ah, uh, that was too intense. That was way too intense. Ah, feeling faint. I got Oh no. Oh frick. Percent bow. Let's see how this works. Where are you going? Uh oh, uh oh, not like this, not like this. Oh no, not like this, not like this. No, I hate it. I hate it. I hate it so much. I hate it. Stop. No. 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 Oh. Oh, what's going on? Ten. <laughs> I know we missed at least one.
Well, <laughs> we're not. We didn't miss. <laughs> oh no! This is not good, chat. This is trouble. Trouble ahead. Get her off dead? I get it delivered. I don't do that in my own self anymore. And. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Get the frick out of here. Oh, you. No, no. Not like this. Oh. Oh, no. No. This frickin' wolf. No. It's gonna kill me. I'm back. Thanks everyone for waiting. All right, any word on the broth? Why is it like it's ridiculous? Why do I get almost 800 calories from one broth? Like, I don't understand. A liter and a half of water and one kilo of ptarmigan. That's insane. I could live off broth forever. Ranger stew is good. Okay, I think we'll, I think what we do is we get to like level, you know, level five cooking, and then we start cooking. And we have we have cash points like this around the map. But I am, I am keeping that broth. That broth is mine. Well, why are we so heavy? Hold on. Dang it. Dang it, Astrid. What's going on? What possibly could be encumbering us right now? Ah, the gloves, chat. The gloves. Where were you on that one? Hey, Slim, good to see you. Welcome in, welcome. We're basically fully kitted out. We're just struggling with inventory management. I, I like, don't even have fuel. Why am I so dang heavy? 70 cattails ones, 70 cattails. 15 arrows. Why do I carry the hatchet? The knife and the hacksaw? It's enough. Right? Dry bar is silly to have. Anyway, we're, we're, we're about four kilos underweight. That's enough for me. Let's go see if there's a bear to shoot. Yeah, I'm, I'm literally just blown away by the broth being so strong. I don't know why I haven't been using that more often. Unless it's like glitched out still. hope there's a bear on this lake, but maybe not. If not, then we'll just go for the coastal highway bears, because there's guaranteed, you know, bears there. Yeah, it's like there's always a missing throat bear, there's always the Bear Creek bear, and there's always the Kwanzaa bear. There's no deviation. So yeah, that's what we'll do. We'll go to Coastal, we'll start with a double bear hunt, that way we have the option of the bear coat in 10 days. We might not even take it, but, like, we have the option.
This will come in handy. I forget how good these huts can be. Like, usually they have loot in them. <clears throat> Yeah, fishing huts in general are worth looking at. There's always something good. Well, not always, you know what I mean. Often, more often than not, there's something good. Mm. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. Okay, we got, what, three wolves right here? Oh, we might want that, but I already, I got the fire book. We need to read that first. Fire starting is a priority right now. All right, let's see if there is a bear. I don't see him. Oh, yeah, there is a bear. Okay, let's loot the cabins and then shoot the bear. Take the hide, leave the guts. Berry bear, yeah, it's gonna be a foggy bear hunt, but I can see him at least. He's way over by his side of the mountain, the side of the lake. The mysterious lake region. Why not? We might find some food. I could I could use a bite. I'll take it. Yoink. 86% it's safe. My assumption is 85% sardines are safe. That could be wrong though. You're gonna need a few guts eventually. Yeah, but the thing is, is I don't want to drag him across the map. And if we kill a bear in Coastal Highway, we just have 10 guts there. Boom. Easy. But no, I, I, I like if I kill the bear here, it, it actually it makes sense to carcass harvest it and throw the guts in a hut somewhere and just forget about them. Take the notes, yeah. The note that won't get updated when we grab all the guts and they're not there anymore. Okay, I think we can just go around. Oh, there's a wolf, sneaky devil. Well, one wolf versus three. You know what? We can just use our, our cunning and our wits. Never mind. I lied. We don't have any of that stuff, chat. Okay. No cunning, no wit, all brute force. Okay. We had a corpse. Yeah. Yeah, see, the thing is, eventually, if I keep taking notes, I'll remember to update the notes. And then that's when there will be a big, like, you know, turning point in my, my gameplay. <laughs> I'll be unstoppable. Once we learn to update our notes, chat. It's all it's gonna take. A whole lot of nothing. You know, just getting a can of sardines and a soda pop is just what I wanted, honestly. Matches got wet, sucks. Sucks for you. Ooh, a fire log. Well, we'll remember that's here for sure. Cabin on the lake with the log. We're being thorough for once, chat. 
I mean, we got the aviators hat out of the last place that we skipped, so. Alright, the bear's still there. Alright, we'll skip that hut. It's not worth it. It's not worth it. Shoot the spare. I'm just gonna use the hut. Eh, hey, Oscar, welcome in. Good to see you. He sees me. Oh, the door is gonna get in my way just in time. Yeah, for my my uh, pro pro bear hunt. <laughs> Did you see how confident I was chasing that bear? Turn right around. <laughs> he turned around, chat. Whoa, did you see her get that hatchet out? Holy. That was aggressive. Yeah, that was that was that was exactly what we intended. Anything right now. Oh my goodness. Okay. Whew. I'm alive. Chat, we're alive. Now, I think what we do is we leave the guts here and take the hide with us to coastal because that's where we're going to be doing our crafting ultimately. And then you know what? Let's move on up to... Let's go to ravine tonight and we'll shoot a deer in the ravine. Leave the bear hide there. Bear was like, haha, lured you to a hut. Oops, not far enough. Yeah, that was almost a disaster. Almost a disaster. Oh, right, there's also lots of Food like potatoes, flour, oil at camp, office. Good. Oh, clip. Nice one. Bear hunting pro. Oh, goodness. It's going to go right to my head. Okay, 19% bow, that's nice. Almost a disaster, yeah, Mr. Barley. That was... Like, I, I thought the bear was running, so I was like, you know, with the wolves, they just keep running. But if... It's like with the moose. If you... If they're in the scared running and you shoot them while you're within their aggro, they turn and run and hit you. It's like the moose. It's like the moose is running scared, but you shoot it, it immediately turns at you. So, yeah. We learned... We've learned lessons, chat. Oof. Should we cook this? No, there's no way. What are we? Cooking three? Yeah, there's no way. We we eat some beans. 32% beans and call it a day. Yeah, thanks for the clip. That's a good one. I know it's going to be a good one.
Let's sit here and eat our broth. Sure. Oh, look at this. Boom. That was pretty potent, that broth. I'm going to make more broth. I think, chat, it's really strong. It's really strong. We all know Rox is the boss here. The broth, yeah, I didn't know it was so good. It, it's like, it was like 750 calories at level 3 cooking. Level 5 cooking broth must be nuts. I, I just basically, what I was doing is I was... I was shooting ptarmigan and having enough feathers on me. So I didn't even care. And then I just stopped shooting them. But now I know you want to shoot all the ptarmigans and make broth. <laughs> Because broth is like the best thing in the game now. Wait, does broth give vitamin C? Oh my goodness. Does it? Where does it tell you? Wouldn't this tell me if it has vitamin C in it? Yeah, I don't know. I'm assuming it maybe doesn't. Hmm. We'll investigate. We'll investigate. I think we'll be making lots of broth. I think it's on the broth itself. Yeah, I don't have any of those, so I can't check that way. It's like, yeah, when you when you hover over the item, it will show you, but I drank it too fast. Their little exhausted walk through some wolf territory. No problem. Hey Cindy, good to see you. Welcome in. Hope you're having a great weekend so far. Hope the nice spring weather is treating you good. What is that? Oh, it's just a backpack. Okay. It's random. Very random. The beautiful weather. Yeah. Uh, it's supposed to get up to like 20 degrees this week. So it's awesome. Picking cattails, chat always. Alright, like we're we're totally not in a rush, but what we're gonna do is go to the ravine, probably just shoot a deer, and while we're cooking it, like read a book. That's that's the plan. That's that's our quest right now. And then we're gonna go to Coastal Highway and do some beachcombing and looting and adventuring. Shoot some bears. We do have that hide still, right? Yeah, good. So we have two bears down, but one of them's in the musk egg, so... You can reheat it for a warmth butt, and it doesn't stink. Wow. Yeah, the broth is apparently the best thing in the game now, apparently, for food. As far as weight, calories, what it costs to make, like, it's cheap. <clears throat> Knowing how many ptarmigan are on some of the maps, like, for example... I'm assuming, too, you can cook broth with rune ptarmigan meat. So, like, you could just harvest ptarmigan and have tons of broth and just live on that. Minus the uh, vitamin C issue, if that's a thing. Alright, is there a wolf? No. Good for us. I'd like to place a stone cache over a campfire, make a mixture smoker. Yeah, we've been talking about a smoker for a while. Something to do more long-term preservation. I mean, tip-ups became a thing. Like, nothing's out of this world. Impossible. Sounds like you make some fire-hardened arrows. Yeah, I've actually never made them, believe it or not. Never made them before. Um, but yeah, that was what I was saying earlier. I think the fire hardened the fire hardened arrows. If you shoot a ptarmigan, the other ones don't fly off. I think that's the 
the bonus. But what I'm worried about is I accidentally select fire hardened arrows when a wolf is charging me or something like that silly happens, you know? You started to get scary, but you warded off. Yeah, I, f I assume you, know, you do it like a lot of fishing or maybe make some like some of those pies that are really high in vitamin C. Like a Thompson's pie would probably just do everything you need. Can you put the broth in a thermal flask? Ooh, good question. Good question, Wojak. Um, does anyone know? Can you can you put broth in a flask? No, you can. Okay, that'd be too. You can? What? You can put broth in a flask? Oh, no, you cannot. Okay, hold on. Chat's contradicting. <laughs> can you put broth in a flask? You can. Okay, there you go. You can heat the broth beside a fire, but can you put it in a flask warm once it's heated? That makes sense. Actually, no, we'll get the we'll get the ravine deer. Ooh, saplings. Wow. OK, broth is stupid strong. It wouldn't let you put it in the flask. Oh, interesting. OK, well, maybe try again if there's like if it has to be hot, Cindy, maybe that's why. Maybe it has to be fresh off the fire or something like that. Wow, a broth in the flask hot hot broth that gives like 800 calories that's nuts okay we're making we're making oh but there's no there's no ptarmigan in coastal or desolation point oof nah whatever we'll figure it out there's no mug for the broth yeah it's a giant it's a giant jar with a liter and a half of broth in it because that's what it says, a liter and a half of water, one kilo of ptarmigan meat, is what you need. You know what? Uh, ooh, I was going to say, let's just hold the flare gun, but then I don't want to waste a flare shot. <laughs> I don't want to waste a flare shot to a wolf. I'll just shoot it in the face. Or what we could do is get a deer to run in advance of us. Yes. Go beyond and then let the wolf eat you. Or not. That did not work. Didn't work at all, chat. Broth on the brain, tomato soup. <laughs> yeah, mix it. Well, you, you can put tomato soups in the uh, thermal flask. I heard. I haven't tried it. There's a bone broth for schema. You can warm it up after it first cool, and it can be put in a flask. Ah, uh, that was fixed and dropped four. Cool. Wow. So broth is ridiculous, basically. Uh, okay. You know what we could do is from Coastal Highway, we could go to Pleasant Valley, and I know for a fact there's ptarmigan in Pleasant Valley. So. We could just load up on Tarmigan from Pleasant. That's really neat. All right, good to know. Thanks for the info. And now we know broth is OP. to look at what's in the dam in case we left something Best be prepared for anything. 27 ouch I mean we could eat that now and see if it gives us food poisoning why not if we do we sleep huh? it's good good bar all right no soups yeah, doing well, doing well. Busy, but good. In a good way. A little tired, but that's to be expected. <laughs> but no, I'm uh, I'm getting... This weekend I got on the list is starts for the garden, so I'm hoping to get 
that's a lot of work, but I'm hoping to get all the starts going. So they'll be ready by next month or so when the garden's ready. Like right now it's really wet still where I am. I'm in like a, a low point of a property on my allotment. So I gotta wait till it dries out before I can work the soil. But I still wanna get the starts ready. So that's, you know, jump, jump on the season a bit. I'm a little late, honestly, I'm a little late. Normally I'd have everything kind of going by now. Ah, uh, peaches. But we can't eat them. Can't eat them, Astrid. Because we need them for the pancakes. All right, let's just leave them at Carter Dam. And I do want to just pop my head in there and see if we left anything. Because there's a chance we put like a bunch of rabbit hides down and forgot about them. It's possible. Alright, cheers everyone. We were today's years old when we discovered ptarmigan were strong. I don't know what I was thinking, I just haven't made broth since it came out basically. And even then I think I only used it as ingredients for the, the soups. The stews, yeah. I was a one track mind. Let's see what we can get in here. Like I said, I'm pretty sure this has stuff in it. Yeah, see? Yeah. Whoa, matches anyone? Holy. All right. 36, 23, 23, 13. Okay, let's just leave all these here. Yeah, we were, we were right. Holy, holy cow. Okay, we'll leave the saplings as well. And then we can just leave a quick note here about Carter Dam. Five birch, lots of matches in front trash. Oop. Do we bother looting? Oh, oh. See, I knew we had, I, I knew we had more, well, there's like a bunch of antibiotics and things too. Rabbit hide, see chat? See? And cold peaches. All right. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. Let's think. We have peaches. We have rabbit hides. How many? Three. So if we get one more rabbit hide, we can make the mitts. So we'll do that in the ravine too, I guess. I'll bring the bear hide with us still. Okay, so what were we doing? We searched like two, one out of every other locker? What the heck? All right, let's, let's not worry about it. This is too stressful for me. Just put it behind us. Okay, we'll go to the ravine, shoot a deer, or two, and while we cook it, we'll, um, cure some things and then read our books, probably, just so we can move on from there. Then we're going beachcombing. Beachcomb adventure. This was one of my first main craft bases, too, right here. I love this spot. Safe passage from wolves if you want. All right, cheers. Cheers, everyone. Happy Saturday. Mm. Anytime now, leave the lake. All right, we got a bit of fuel, but we should probably pick up some sticks. And we're going for a buck chat. We don't want to mess with the dough. New location. So we haven't been down here yet. 
Um, ooh, ooh, I know I'm gonna want to go to the Blick Inlet and grab the code. Because if we get the code, then... <laughs> I'm so sidetracked already because if we get the code then we can at least enter from the muskeg later on and and have that as an option which I like right like I don't like saying oh I want to go to bleak and being like oh well I can't because the code's up top and I'm down below kind of puts a, a damper on navigating the region there's always birch in the ravine guaranteed spawn three different locations and I feel like the, I don't know, quote me on this, don't quote me on this, but I feel like the birch or the maple spawn in Winding River is guaranteed as well. There seems to be always maples up top above the rabbit cave. It's a buck chat. Oh, he took that one. All right. Dang it, we can't run. Oh, let's cut. Let's cut. Let's cut around. Yeah, he took that. I think it was a neck shot, so he should be bleeding out soon. But watch this. Come around the other side. Come around the other side. Never mind. Yeah, that's that's why I always tell people if they're if they're like I don't know what I'm doing with the bow, go to the ravine, shoot a couple rabbits, shoot a couple deer. You know, it's it's the only spot in the game where you can literally just shoot a deer and know for sure you're gonna find it. Like there's other areas like say camp office, you shoot that deer, you're never finding that deer. What's going on? Oh no, watch him like be up in the ha up in the mountains. Hey Kunal, good to see you. Happy Saturday, my friend. Hope you're well. Yeah, and plus two, you get to learn how to track. Feels like night is coming. Oh, night's here, Astrid. Oh, and we want one rabbit, too. Oh, hello. There he is, chat. We've done it. Tracked. Yeah, actually, I don't even... I don't even care. Let's go. Carcass harvest! Attack! If we lose in the rocks, it's lame, but... It's a price I'm willing to pay. It's very possible, though, that we lose part of this deer. Mmm, looks good. All right, go Astrid, go. It's only gonna take us 10 years to get to our cave. I guess, mm, I'm not gonna be able to uh, I'm doing good, Canal Sorry, I missed that. I am, yeah, no, I'm doing good. I was saying earlier, my kid had their, their six month checkup and they're doing great. They're like 
growing very, very fast and, you know, all the percentiles are, are great. All right, we're going, we're still going slow, but we're going not as slow. Domo, oh my goodness, good to see you. 37 months. W7 glorious months with one. Thank you so much, Domo, hope you're doing well. Great to see you. Six months already, yeah. Time flies, time flies. Domo, hope you're doing well, hope everyone's doing good. Let's just get Astrid back to this cave, we'll, we'll start processing. We can definitely go ahead and sleep too. But yeah, I hope everyone's doing good. Hope everyone's having a great uh, start to the spring. Spring feels definitely where I am. It's starting to, like we had snow last week, but now it's like warm. Now it's warm. Oh, you're sick. Oh, Domo, I'm sorry. Well, I hope you feel better very fast. Hope you get well soon. Six months is fun. Yeah, it's like um, a lot of stuff is starting to happen. A lot of personality and characters being developed and stuff too now, which is really cute. Going to Hush River soon? Well, we kind of talked about it. We were like, do we go to Hush River? Do we go to Forsaken Airfield? Or we go to uh, Coastal Highway? So we're going to Coastal Highway. And really what I want to do here is just probably play with the beach combing a bit and fishing. Because we haven't done that yet. <clears throat> and then get our cooking to five. And then we'll, yeah, then we'll go to the um, like Hush River side of the map into Forsaken Airfield. Yeah, we got time. We're not in any rush. We're only on day like 25. Hey, cool blade. Good to see you. It's been a minute. Hope you're doing well, my friend. Archery 5? <laughs> no. No. Shabby, good to see you, Shabby. Welcome. Thank you for the raid. Welcome, raiders. But yeah, cool blade. Hope you're doing well. It's been a minute. Hope, uh, hope all's good in your world. We're just here playing TLD. I'm kind of like very limited on Twitch these days, but I try to pop on once in a while. Oh, thank you, Cool Blade. Yeah, it was um, big life change. Big life change. Hey, Nuka, good to see you. Thanks for coming by. And Shabby, hope you're doing well. Hope uh, hope the run's going good. What kind of uh, kind of adventures are you into? But yeah, six months already has passed, so it's time is flying by. Flying by? It's flying by. Alright, I know I'm going to forget about those two bags of meat, but that's fine. Let's just back in here. Drop this. Okay. And then what we'll do is, um, I don't know, I don't know, sleep I guess? And then process tomorrow when they're all frozen? Oh, we need a rabbit. We need a rabbit, chat. Man, I could use a drink. Dang it. That's fine. Let's just go ahead and feed Astra a drink and sleep. We'll deal with this tomorrow. D125. Nice. Nice, nice. Good work. Yeah, Nuke is streaming too, The Long Dark. Check it out. Always uh, some fun challenge going on over there. Oh, we have a lot of cattails. That's why we're so slow. It's fine. I, I carry all the cattails. That way we don't have to worry about hunting all the time. So that's the that's the trade-off. Let's go ahead and get like eight hours. It's plenty. It's more than enough. But yeah, I'm doing well. Everyone thinks you're asking about me and yeah, sorry for my like lack of streams, but I'm going to try to be hitting a one, a minimum one per week is the goal. <laughs> okay, now we've got a blizzard. Let's yeah, let's just process this and then we'll light the fire. Two, three. Nice. Nice. You're in Blackrock, I'm moosing about, nice. Blackrock is uh, one of my favorite maps, I think. I like it even with the Timberwolf annoyance. I think the prison's a really neat like, part of the world, and the mill and, and the gold mine, or not the gold mine, just the mine. I'm a big fan of that map. 
It definitely was a little overwhelming at the start. I didn't understand what the heck I was doing. Like I'd get on a river and I didn't know which river or I'd be on the road and I had no idea which direction I was going. Okay, now we've got two more bags out there. We can always run and grab them. After we light the fire, all the cool kids are here. Yeah, I know we got a we got a whole crowd today. But again, thank you everyone who's here and all the streamers hanging out. Great to see you and thank you for you know putting streams out there while I'm not because I've definitely been slacking on that front. Yeah, we need water. Good. The BR team used on bottom as much as the bleak ones? Really? See, I've heard exactly the opposite from everyone, Shabby, because like the the bleak Timberwolves, on, they seem to when you break their morale, they seem to actually stay away. Whereas the Blackrock Timberwolves, you break their morale and they're back on you in like two minutes. <laughs> it seems. But that just might be my experience, and that might be like, you know. A little outdated. All right, we got water, we got meat. Let's give Astrid a special drink here. Go ahead and have a birch tea. New daddy takes some time. It does, yeah. It's like I had I had visions of me streaming at night, like you know, put the kid down to bed, turn the stream on, get get three or four hours in. I, I will say though, the kid is going to bed earlier now. Back before the four month mark. It was like nine o'clock that time and now it's seven o'clock that time, which is nice, but I'm I'm still exhausted by the end of that. And I just I sit on the couch for about an hour and then I go to bed. Okay, where was that deer? It was across the wither the wither? The withered rock over here. Sleep is golden, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nap when they nap, but I'm not good at naps. I'm not good at naps. You like running around broken? Yeah, once you learn Broken Railroad and you see all the different shortcuts you can take. Oh good, I was like, why is there only one bag? But yeah, I like how Blackrock has the steam tunnels. It has like that kind of weird rope bypass over an area, like there's a lot of different stuff going on there, which is neat. Rest in self-care, yeah. Try to find the time. <laughs> you lost your 200 day run to the Bleak Timbies? Oh no. I do like Black Rock. Like I I struggled with it a lot when it first came out, but uh, Elkor, I do this challenge on every new map where I have to spawn in the map and live there for 50 days. So by the end of those challenges, I learned pretty much how the, how the map works, basically. So I got a lot more confidence. But before you learn the map, it's really overwhelming. And oh shoot, minus five feels like holy. All right, we're wasting a coal. Oh, interesting. It canceled out. I canceled and it didn't have any meat in my inventory. So did they get rid of micro harvest? Is micro harvesting not in the game anymore? What? Yeah, the bleak Timberwolves, I feel, aren't as aggressive as the Timberwolves in Blackrock. But that might be just my experience. There's math. Oh, okay, then it's not happening. The guy who drank his own pee doesn't seem so crazy right now. Oh, well, I guess what you could do is, like, take the, the bag of meat back to the smaller amount. Okay, 15 till boiled, and then what we'll do is we'll read our book after. Oh, no, we should go grab a rabbit first. Okay. All right, we're good to go. Let's get a rabbit from down here. 
And then that will be everything we need for our mitts, potentially. You can go max and back to smallest. Yeah, that's that's what I was thinking. Like, you can get it to be like legal 0. 0.1 or 0. 0.2 size. Scurvy gone. <laughs> yeah, apparently um, scurvy can be pretty serious, but if you get like a bunch of fishing done, maybe not so bad. Wait, you can't break the animation? Oh, the micro harvest. Uh, you have to let the animation finish. I gotcha. You can't cancel out. Makes sense. Okay, let's find one rabbit. That's all we need. Wait, what? This is a rabbit spawn. Where's my rabbit? There we go. I feel like every time I'm shooting, I'm breaking arrows. Good stuff. Let's just grab a bit of fuel and head on back. Scurvy is more of a nuisance. Yeah, it's like, oh, great. Now, instead of doing the stuff I wanted to do, I got to focus on fishing for three days. Yeah, exactly. It's like when you get intestinal parasites and it's like, OK, I guess I go got to go pick 40 mushrooms. Thanks, TLD. Yeah, it's totally kind of uh, throws a wrench into the plans, but I feel like my early game gameplay style, I eat enough stuff that it's not going to matter but later on when I get cooking five I'm going to have to just like get some fishing in somehow to supplement because when you're just eating straight bear and wolf obviously, obviously that's when it's an issue that's why they put it in because that's what happens you get cooking five and you just eat rancid bear meat all day long there is one more deer in this map if we want it Except you lay death as part of the process. Nice. W w oh, you put uh, what's that? W wolf, wang w wolf wrangler. That's a mouthful. Wolf wrangler in the back burner. I hear ya. Sometimes challenges are just they get you, you just keep doing and doing and doing it. Hey, trooper, thank you for the raid. Oh my goodness, we got so many raids today. Thank you for coming by and welcome in raiders. I hope you had a good stream. We're just here, kind of chilling in the ravine before we move on to coastal highway for some beachcombing fishing we're paint we're basically just doing vanilla interloper no drama no challenge just trying to play the game <laughs> have some fun hey stewie welcome in and trooper thanks for the raid i hope you had a great great stream yeah just to let everyone know we just finished our crafting so we we now have the moose satchel um some deer gear we made a wolf coat uh we got the the good setup we're at 22 plus 11 38 percent protection 70 per sprint so like this is I'm, I'm pretty content with this this is gonna last me a while the only thing we're gonna upgrade is probably to mittens uh to rabbit mitts which we just got our last hide for and we don't need to cook all this i'm just sort of here to kill some time and i'm gonna, I'm gonna like read a book Wolf Wrangler, there's a lot of great elements, make a good training ground. Yeah, the whole thing with like the bow speed run, for me, it gets a little frustrating because that, that's like a lot of that's RNG. Like, do we get a good spawn? Do we get a good hacksaw? Do we get the early maple? You know, there's a lot of like pressure on yourself, but it can be fun and it really does teach you the game for sure. All right, what do we, what do we got here? Let's eat all these little pieces. 
Hey, Jen, good to see you. Happy Saturday. Check out Jen streaming the inheritance of Crimson Manor. That sounds like a horror game. Nice one. Hope you're doing well, Jen, and I uh, hope the streams are going good. All right, full belly. We got meat here to process. We got water. What, what am I missing? <sighs> oh, right, I wanted to read the book. That's what we were doing. Uh, yeah, Firestar book. That's the one. Hey, thank you for the cheer, Long Holler. Appreciate you. Welcome in. Wow, I feel like I'm missing chat. There's a lot of action. There's a lot of action here today. 40 minutes. Let's keep going. 40, 40, 40, 40, 40, 40. Yes, should work. We'll let the fire go out. And then try to finish this book. Embers, okay. No problem. I don't know if this is gonna work. Maybe we might have enough energy. Yes, perfect timing. Cook or fire start three, please. No, not even close. Oh, we're like so many fires away. Better scope, yeah. New carry heading out. All right, thanks for hanging, and uh, hope, uh, yeah, hope uh, whatever you get up to is good for you. Hey, Storm Tiberius, welcome in. Lucky start. Started gun loper run. Found a bunker load with guns. Nice. Yeah. When you do custom, you can get the potential full, full bunker of treats, and that's pretty sweet. All right. Do we sleep, chat? Sleep a whole night. I'm trying to think. Maybe we just move on through. Whoa. Yeah, let's get a good rest, and then we'll read our archery book in the morning, or the night, even. Yeah, we could sleep five hours, read our book for five hours. Oh, this is the plan. Yeah, let's go six hours of sleep, then we'll read, <laughs> and then we'll sleep. It feels like minus four. Oh, we were, we weren't even we weren't even in the back of the cave chat. We weren't even in the back of the cave. We just went to sleep for six hours outside on the ground and it wasn't even a problem because it feels like minus four plus seven in our bedroll. That's just too funny to me. All right. OK, let's see if we can read this book. Done. Oh, it's too dark to read. One hour left. Okay, it's fine. We'll sleep. The power of ptarmigan leftovers. Cutting a bear into... Yeah, you can actually cut a bear into the Timberwolf pack to delete their aggro, which is kind of crazy. Cue the blizzard. Feels like minus three. Or, nah, we're, we're fine. There's no way we're not fine. Ten hours sleep, coldest time of day. <laughs> that music scared me for a second. It sounded like the you're almost dead music. I'm not even kidding. <laughs> okay. We lived. We're fine. Let's read that last hour of our archery book. Dump that here and then we go. Okay, we got 
We got the stuff, chat. 73 cattails. I feel like we have too many cattails. Cutting bears, yeah. They're slow moving that as long as you stay a, a ways away and you got enough rocks, take the beer. I'm gonna take the uh, the beer. I'm gonna take the bear hide. You're right, I don't wanna forget that. Ooh, archery four, it worked. Okay, we'll take the bear hide and the rabbit hide. Yes. Yeah, we'll leave everything else. So that way we come back here, there's like a bit of a setup for us. Okay, we'll bring two sticks. And all the water. Sprain risk. No, we should be fully optimized. Fully optimized. Okay, we, we really should drop some cattails. 23. There, we got 50 cattails. Pretty soon we'll drop the bow. Oh, what a beauty day. Alright, moving on. You got to take team by the wolves and the bear. That's how the plan fails sometimes, yeah. Oof. Traveling cattail salesman. You know, I know there's always been part of me who wants to collect all the cattails, but then I always eat them so fast that I'd never be able to do that. Yeah, no, we, we, we're trying to actually go... Like, it feels so good when you're not encumbered, Trooper. Like, when you go around the world, like, five kilos underweight, it feels like you're running, even though you're just walking. I was gonna make the joke, but abstain. Apparently I had a cool train, though. Every time she says rocks, she looks like I'm about to jump off of, of a bush like Beetlejuice. What? I have no idea what's going on. What joke? What did I miss? Uh, I don't even bother going and deploying this rope anymore. It seems like kind of a waste of time. Maybe we should, but next time, if we find the rope here, we can go back. Hydrate? You know what? I actually don't even have a drink right now. I gotta go get my water. You mentioned lots of rocks. Ah, yes. Understood. <laughs> Alright, I'll be right back. I'll go grab a water because I don't have one for some reason. BRB. from grandmother oh cindy thank you for the cheer ognisco ognisco let's put some bad tick in it Maybe we'll process some torches. <laughs> it's over. It's over. We missed. We missed. We missed. We missed. Right? I'm pretty sure that first one went over his head. Yeah. Rip. Rip. Oh, all we can do is try. Yeah, it's 100 bits or resub. Whoa! What the hell just happened? Oh my god! Oh my god! Astrid, you almost died! What are you talking about? I wasn't paying attention. Holy crap. We got cold, folks. To the circle. Oh god. It's all over. We're so lost. We just did a circle around. Oh god.
What is going on? I don't know how to draw. Oh my god. So bad. So bad. Oh. God. Well, I don't know what the hell this is. I'm sorry. Don't show that clip to my significant other. <laughs> All right. I just thought of something. You know, it'd be crazy if they let us stack the bedroll. Cause like we could get in a cloth bedroll and then put that inside the bare bedroll, right? Why not? Why can't I do that? Why can't I do that? Is this a deer carcass? What's this doing here? I, I, it's so random, I just don't think I've ever seen a deer on this side of the map before. And then something's over here, floating deer. Oh yeah, it's like earlier today we saw the hacksaw for the first time. What is going on here? Where are these birds even? What's, what's over here, Chad? I've never been here before. Is this something? I've literally never been here before. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get soft locked or something, aren't I? Death wall? Oh, okay. <laughs> no. No, thank you. I don't know. Oh, you're kidding? Oh, okay. Well, I was half expecting it. Like, I know there is death walls in the ravine, so I don't, I don't want to be risking it. You have no idea. Well, I was going to say it could be on the bottom. Like, you know how you climb down the rope and there's like a corpse down there? Yeah, I have no idea. Maybe. Oh, 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 Elcor, you're right. It's probably like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. It's like the other boxcar. There's a corpse there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes way more sense than my idea. There's like a secret hidden corpse in like an out of bounds area. No. You may notice I have the grass cranked to a hundred, which is lovely and all, but then you can't see the birch bark, which is fine, but, or your arrows, you know, if you go shooting. Never know. New peach is ruined. I'll just leave these here. Oh, there's the, oh, what? A hammer? Do I bring this with me? Into, Coastal? Dang. Yeah, apparently there's there's like four hammer spawns in the ravine. I think I think there's like a lot of hammers in the area. Okay, let's just leave it here and then we'll note it. Uh, what do we have? Deer, hide, guts, food in cave near dam, other cave has hammer. Boom. And we'll put some asterisks by there. So we remember. So we remember. Take it. Well, that's what I was thinking. Like, we're like, uh, you're right. I should take it there because then, uh, no, like I literally was like, we should take it to the forge and drop it there, if anything. Okay, we could leave the bow behind. What can we? What can we dump? Ooh, the can. Yep. Mm. Manage the inventory. Okay, we'll leave a steak. Boom. Under underweight. Look at that. Look at that perfection. Chat. Four four point nine nine out of forty five. It's almost like we know how to play this game. 
We're just not allowed to pick anything up. We're not allowed to pick anything up. Flares are heavy, but I, I like having at least two, and I think I have three on me. So that, like, that's almost a kilo in flares. Four flares is a kilogram, so yeah. Uh, you gotta you gotta watch the flare flare count. I think I have one too many, but what I'll do is I'll I'll go to fishing camp and I'll I'll dump I'll dump a bit of stuff there probably. Do you have acorns to play with? No, I left them all. Like here's the here's the tentative idea is I'm not gonna really do any cooking other than maybe broth because there's like infinite salt. It's like 0 0.01 salt per broth and it's like. You'll never run out, so I'm probably gonna leave all the cooking until level five, and then I'll start making pies and stews and yeah, wash on, wash off. I've I've left uh, caches of food and flour in different main spots, so that's the idea. Is I'll wait till I get cooking five, and then I'll start messing. Get the fishing camp bear. Uh, the problem with the fishing camp bear is like usually if you don't kill it outright, it's hard to find. Like it's it has a large area that it will like travel to once it's dying. So I usually try to get that bear down dead and not have to chase a bleeding of bear. But that was like one of the first bears I was hunting because in my first like good run, I, I spent a lot of time in Coastal Highway on Interloper. It was my happy place and that bear had to be dealt with because I crafted at that bench. So that was always a big ordeal. I would shoot the bear and go inside the cabin. That was what I did. <laughs> That's how I played. Shoot the bear, go in the cabin, hope it died. Realize that it didn't, and then get confused. Yeah, it's like, uh, I don't know about other bears, but that bear's range, he can go all the way down to the ice, where the fishing huts, all the way up to the top of the map almost. And then, oh. Oh no, chat. We're fully optimized. Hold on. If we drop a stick and some cattails. <laughs> oh, we're back. Fully optimized. No strain risk. Oh no. All right. Just, just drag it with us. No, you know what? I think four coal is enough coal. That's. Uh, my my old interloper play was too cool. Ten six, I think, is what I'd carry with me. And now it's like I feel like too cool is probably enough to get you out of any anything. Minus forty, two hours of fire time. Yeah, so four coal should be more than enough. Challenge is never to be overweight. No, it's not a challenge. It's just something I'm, I'm fiddling with because I feel like you just move so much swifter when you're not encumbered. And it's a good habit to be in to try to have your build optimized to be like around five kilos underweight. But obviously right now I'm traveling between maps, so I'm not going to be at 40 kilos. But once we stop and drop the bear hides, you know, we'll be we'll be at 40 probably. And then it will feel feel nice again. All right, here we go. We'll shoot the bear on the creek, probably. And then we'll get a good harvest in. Yeah, see, there's like a bunch of coal here. We could bring that into the map if we wanted, but it's fine. We're not hurting for it. This is like, we could go to Coal Mountain through Cinder Hill and, and get all the coal we could ever want. What are these snowflakes doing? How are you so warm? Well, it's day 25 and we have 22 warmth plus 11 wind chill. So we're rocking 33 warmth basically, which is crazy. But, you know, this is uh, the deer pants, combat pants, deer boots, full underwear. One extra improvised insulation gives you plus three degrees in itself. These are our weakest link, but we're going to upgrade those soon. And then we've got the wolf coat, which is brand new, 4-4 almost, and the Mackinac. We've got the wool toque and the aviator cap, which is a, also 4 degrees. Like, this cap is nuts. This is a 4 degree hat when you account for wind chill. Like, right now, it says it's minus 6 wind chill, so half of our wind chill bonus isn't being effective, but we're still at, like, 24 warmth, which is crazy. <laughs> Wait, hold on. 
minus six wind chills, so we're at 28 warmth, feels like. Is what our, like, um, warmth bonuses if we're factoring in the current wind chill. And, and this is no wind, keep in mind. Any more wind than this? Like, this is zero wind, it's still minus six wind chill, if that makes sense. Thin wool sweater. Okay, this is the thing. The the thin wool sweater and the hockey jersey are the same. Unless you don't have a jacket, then the, the jersey's good because it's huge wind chill bonus. But you don't get that bonus when you're wearing another jacket. So it's like, this is useless. It's it's better to wear two thin wool sweaters that are 0 0.5 to 0.25 than this, which is 0.3. Because the stat of warmth is all you're getting. You're only getting the warmth stat. So the wind chill doesn't factor in when it's an inner layer. But it's a hockey jersey, I have to wear it, I'm Canadian. So that's, we'll take the 0 0.05 carry capacity deficit so we can be, you know, wearing the, wearing the stuff. But yeah, uh, optimized is two thin wool sweaters. And then as soon as you put a jacket on top of that, you don't get the windshield bonus of those inner, inner coats. Oh, you know what, we have our stinky meat, so. The wolf or the wolves and the bear might just come to us. Oh. That was bound to happen. I always think I'm hearing the bear, but it's the sound of the waves. <laughs> no, no, I'm uh, I'm from Canada. I'm on the west coast. If I can't see the bear yet, he's probably down. Down the mountain still. Oh, I hear him. No? Yeah, again, it's just the waves I'm hearing. Hey, hey, Quill, good to see you. Welcome in. How's Lethal Company going for you? Good to have you. Poker face? Oh god. England does that to the sounds? Yeah, there's a few areas where it's like there's a lot of noise. It's hard to hear things. I mean, this is the bear's house. Let's get him to see me. Alright. Alright. He's seen me. We don't have to hunt him down. Oh, oh. Drop the meat so we won't get mauled by the wolf midway through this. <laughs> Easy. Oh, foggy day too. I love it. Ballsy. Yeah, well, there's a strategy where... You can basically use like the bear. The bear can't do a sharp turn, so you can, you know, close range work around that. It's a little cheesy, but you can do it. All right, let's go ahead and just be the wolf. But we'll be safe. We'll be safe, chat. We'll be safe. That way we don't have to worry about getting jumped. You yeah, haven't so much fun with Lethal. I played it once, cool. I want to play it again. I do. Um, I need to just like jump in and get like a, a short amount of time. I, I always think, oh, I need a chunk of time to game, but I could I could game for an hour or two here or there and, and enjoy it. But that was a lot of fun. I enjoyed Lethal. I played with uh, 
And I play with uh, Deadpool and uh, a few others. But yeah, it's uh... <laughs> I hate to say it, but you know, Dead Deadpool and I have a long-standing uh, history. And uh, I kind of ple played a bit ignorant to the rules, even though I knew them. But yeah, I had a lot of fun messing with Deadpool. <laughs> it was good. You're at East Coast time, so what's that, like four hours? So right now it's 11 a.m. where I am. 11 a.m. I want to beachcomb real quick. But we're definitely encumbered. I just want to do, I just want to like do a quick sweep here and up to the cabin. Three hours before? Huh? Before? I thought we're as before as it gets. I can't even see, we're gonna get lost. Oh, three, add, add three, okay, yeah, 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 that, that makes sense. All right, chat, we're lost. I have no idea where we are now. All right, we found the edge, so now we turn and walk. And eventually we'll see the hut, and then we'll see uh, Jackrabbit Island. Oh, starting to see things. Hey, hey, Rua, good to see you. Welcome in. Drop a stick. <laughs> oh, yeah, I, I never remember. There, see, we can drop this stick. <laughs> Put it down. What does this all mean? So that way's north? Or that way's north? Ooh, a cattail. We'll never know. But yeah, I, I gotta remember to do that in advance, so now we know. The, the stick basically points to the shore, the road. So that's helpful, if we remember to do that. <laughs> that's the key. I feel like we should be seeing the fishing hut by now. Oh, there it is! Look, chat. We found it. Nice work. Another raid! Slim, good to see you, my friend. Welcome in. Thank you for bringing your folks over here. Welcome, welcome everyone. And Wands, we're just playing vanilla interloper right now. We just shot the bear, so we're wa walking around the fog with all of its guts. Yeah, we got all all that bear on us. But we're doing some beachcombing while we wake, make our way into coastal coastal highway. But we are decked out. We got the we got the warm and fast build basically. We're kind of light and lethal. Kind of kind of strong, chat. It's been good. But yeah, we've basically just been playing Vanilla Loper, so obviously we're thriving. We're thriving. <laughs> but Slid, I hope you're doing doing well playing TLD. I'm sure you're doing some crazy challenge. But yeah, we're just doing the Vanilla, Vanilla Lope. <laughs> we're gonna bring, yeah, we're gonna bring something to us. I'm really surprised we haven't seen more wolves. But I think what happens is they sent you, and then they head in that direction they first sent it to you. So by the time... By the time the wolves get to where we originally were, we're way off, so they keep perpetually following behind where you are. Oh, never mind, there's one. Yeah, just kill this wolf. And then... Maybe all the wolves at Kwanzaa we can, or uh, not Kwanzaa, fishing camp, and we can all set up there. Got a new time on the wolf bear moose challenge, nice. So basically that one is the speed run to kill all wolf a bear and a moose, right? What's your time now? 
Yeah, that's a whoa, another raid. Oh my goodness. We've been getting the raids today. Thank you, Bash. Good to see you. Huge raid. Thank you. Hope you had a good stream and uh, hope you had some fun. Everyone, welcome in. I'm Wands. I'm, I'm fully, fully whelmed. Fully overwhelmed now. We're just basically in Coastal Highway doing some chill loper beachcomb. But I think what we need to really do is drop off all the stuff we have on us. So let's go to fish camp and we can get that thing, all that, all that stuff curing there. Chat had fun, you almost died. Oh no, what happens? That's, uh, that's rough to hear. Hey Zed, welcome in. Helga, good to see you, welcome. All these lovely folks. Oh yeah, we got the, we got the whole crew here tonight, folks. Everyone's here. Oh, the, it's getting clearer now. I can see again. Oh, that's good. We're struggle. Really? Oh my. Well, to hear that you're struggling, that's... That's pretty wild. I know you're very competent, so... <laughs> hey, thanks for following. Holy balls in hell. Holy balls. Welcome in. Welcome to the Grim Gang. Oh, they're just over flyover headbirds. Oh, wolf struggle. Which is struggle in general. <laughs> Did it take you like down 90 health or something? But welcome everyone. Sorry if I'm missing chat. There is a lot of action here today. But thank you for joining everyone. Thank you for being here. Let's go set up at uh, fish camp and we'll get our things carrying. We'll get notes that way. There's a maple, there's guts, there's a bear hide. Or is it two bear hides now that we have? Yeah, two bear hides. Okay. So in case we want to upgrade the Mackinac to the bear coat, we have that option. I don't think I do though. I think I like the wolf coat Mackinac combo. I mean, I spent so long just rolling with the bear, that like double bear coat, that I think changing it up to the wolf coat only is not terrible. Didn't have my hacks hunting knife. Would be dead. Oh jeez. That guy who drank his own pee doesn't seem to so get crazy eaten around by raids. Yeah, I used to stream every day, but I, uh, I, my work schedule doesn't allow it. I have a kid, so I'm kind of just streaming once, twice a week if I can. But I do have some fun when I get out here, so thanks for joining. Alright, let's set up in this first one. I like this one because it has all the drawers. Alright, we made it. We made it. Okay, let's just eat this. All done. Now we gotta go hunt for our food or eat our excessive amount of cattails. Oh, you know what else we should do? Is here, I'll just start a fire because we're low on torches. Yeah, and that way we can just pull torches when we leave. Oh, cheers, I forgot to hydrate. We got all this water. Harvest the bear? Hmm. The thing is, is like, I don't really cook bear meat until I get cooking five. <laughs> I have this weird thing where, like, if I'm not going to eat it right away, I don't bother cooking it. So I just get cooking off of uh, the deer, ptarmigan, teas, stuff like that. And that seems to work pretty well for me. Like, I used to, don't get me wrong, I used to cook the crap out of every bear and wolf I saw and then get the stats for it, but... Now I just rather cook what I'm going to eat, and then I know there will always be meat later on. It's a bit wasteful, but yeah, I, I just feel like by day 30 or 40, I'm going to get cooking five, or I could get it by day 20 if I want, if I cook the, the bear meat. And I'm not that, I'm like, I'm not that aggressive anymore. I'd rather just chill, <laughs> if that makes sense. Okay, now we have our torches. One, two bear hides. We have... The maple and one birch. Let's get the uh, rabbit hides down too. And we might as well leave the cured guts here since this is our place now. 
go ahead and loot the drawer. Yeah, we got a heist. Let's go, Captain Quill and Torius Thief. Creeping a crew. Creeping a crew. Oh, wait, let's put some stuff in here. Uh, let's leave the hammer in here for now. What am I doing? What am I doing, chat? Oh, it's full already? Get out of here. Oh, I'm 38 kilos. I'll take it. That's good. That's enough. Alright, we gotta take the note. Always with the notes. What else? I don't even remember what I just dropped off here. Other stuff like tools, maybe? Yeah, maybe. Oh, the maple. The maple. Yeah, I gotta talk about that. Okay, good. All right, let's go mm -hmm. do that there. Let's do the rest of this place and then just move on. I want to do more. We have like enough energy. The weather's turning nice. Oh, the crew. Some of the crew made it. Some of the crew made it. Nice ice. Nice one. Oh, there's a first aid kit in the wall. I don't notice that. We'll, we'll leave it for next next time Wands comes over here. Hey, Cindy, thank you for the 37 months. That's amazing. Appreciate that support. Ooh, 93%. Yoink. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, that's amazing. Sunshine here, too. Spring feels in the air. Oh, I'm glad to hear it. Thank you, Cindy. Appreciate it. Oh, the hammer. Did I leave the hammer? Thank you. That's important. That's what I meant by tools. <laughs> like tools, maybe. Hammer. Asterisk. Asterisk. Thank you. That's yeah, that's that's what we needed. All right, let's get uh... I guess what we could do is just walk the beach now, like the, the sky's clear. Looks like one wolf out there. Ooh, ragged. No, we already have, we have everything. Hammer all caps, yeah, no, I got the axe tricks. It'll remind me, I'm sure. All right, that wolf can chill. I didn't see any deer. I was hoping to get a few deer spawned in so we could just get some meat in the ground, but we'll just go to log sort. There's like three deer there always. Log sort. The log sort herd, we call it. <clears throat> Back in the outer Nogoa days, that was a prime, prime hunting spot. Lots of wolves to shoot in note mode, lots of venison, but I don't know. It's been so long. I got betrayed. <laughs> I know. The new heist can be a little, a little brutal. Yeah, I try to write down um, as much info as I can, just because like I'm very forgetful. So it's good to have notes that help me tell me where I left like my pile of mushrooms or my pile of stims or whatever. I'm, I decide I can't carry at the time. Is that a deer I see? Or a wolf? I think that is a deer. You know what, why don't we, why don't we hunt this wool or this wolf? Yeah, this venison. Oh, that didn't work. Okay.
think he's facing away from me right now. Yeah. We're gonna lose this arrow. Quonset is the only move spawn for Coastal, yep. It's kind of like Trappers, it's a static moose spawn with no moose markings. We, we definitely missed that one. No! Ah, oh, that didn't even hit! Whoops. All right, two arrows. We'll never find them, chat. What is going on? I'm gonna have to like put something down here to remember. No idea where those arrows went. There's no footprints to help me. <laughs> Okay, I think what we do now is attempt to shoot this guy for redemption, and then, like, later... Oh, are you kidding me? Oh, we got the hit at least this time. So now he's definitely gone. Oh, oh, the wolf might help. Get him, get him! Get him! Oh, he's too fast. This is a train wreck. Oh my goodness. Two arrows. Huh? Wait, did I? Huh? How did I pick up two arrows? What? What is going on? Do we even have fuel? <sighs> this is a great idea, chat. Just watch the Aurora start. Fishing hut over there. Our arrows are over at that hut, I think, though. So let's go that way. I can barely walk with this much gear. Every wolf on the planet is coming for me. What are we doing? What are we doing, chat? Death wish? <laughs> I lost two arrows, all right? We basically need to restart anyways at this point. But we don't get to see you. Um, yeah, we're um, we're having some fun. We're having some fun. 
Plus, I like getting all these walls down so that way it's safer to walk around with me later. Yeah, but that first two misses on that deer, I think we had two misses. And then you're right, I think we had one in each wolf and deer and they stacked them together. But this is where, yeah, they respawn really quick, but at least I'll have some time to have a little bit of a reprieve from the wolves. Plus two, my archery skill will get up to five quicker. Uh, I have a 15, a 10% bow that I'm carrying right now, so I'm, I'm ready to get this thing destroyed. We're gonna be able to do this honestly there's um i think i have like one stick and one log hey it's warm in here <laughs> we could just sleep here oh my goodness look at this i'm not even kidding we can just sit here and harvest just like a, a maniac here okay done 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 we're warm This is too funny. Our loper uh, outfit is putting in some work now. Oh, it's getting cold. Oh no, it feels like minus zero. Yeah, it's it maybe maybe feels like minus one. Hydrate. Cheers. I actually have water now. It's dark. We're in a fishing hut. <laughs> With a whole lot of venison. Alright. Done. So we got all that. I think I left the guts and the hide on the ice. We can pick that up tomorrow. I, I just want to find the arrows. We're going to sleep here probably while we can, and then we'll light a fire. We found a 27% ragged wool toque in another hut already. Wait a second, they're not going to let me put this over here now? Oh no. Oh. I don't have any drinks. Dang it. We always do this, Astrid. <laughs> At once, what? Oh, oh heart rate monitor. Oh my goodness. Okay. Thank you. Nice one. Give me a minute. I just gotta turn on my phone. Good one. Good to see you, Black Mage. Welcome. All right. 88. Nice. Feels like s four hours of sleep. <laughs> Let's go. I'm sure we'll be fine. We have a seven degree bed roll. Feels like yeah, it still would be warm. I feel like I could actually see better the arrows now if we walked over that way.
13 arrows. We had so many more. How many broken ones do we have? One. Getting a bit thirsty. Four. So there's some arrows out there. Well, I want to try to look. Maybe the light of my torch will make things easier. So this is like the original hunting ground. Yeah, we got noisemakers when we spawned in Black Rock because we went to the mine and they give you four, I think, and we we used one on a herd, no, a covey of ptarmigan. A covey. All right, chat, scream at me if you see an arrow. I thought it was in this area, but I could very well be uh, wrong. Yeah, there's... It's gonna be tough. The problem was, is it was night. It was night when we did this. Oh, what's that? A torch? Okay, that doesn't help. That torch indicates the area, though, I think. Yeah. Didn't we, like, drop the torch and shoot at it from over here? Then it ran this way. I can't feel my feet. I have no idea. Hey, thanks for following the Poppy Gamer. Welcome in. Oh, we found one. Okay, okay, okay. So this is the either first one or second one. So let's go this way just to confirm. Got it. At least the scares once get across the ice. Yeah. Exactly. Or they'd bounce and like ricochet for miles. But thank you, uh, everyone. Welcome in. Good to have you. Roz, welcome to the stream. Thanks for joining. Yeah, for those who came in on raids, thanks for being here. I'm Wands. I stream once, twice a week tops now. I used to stream a lot, so um, thanks for being here. Give me a shot, checking the channel out. Right now we're hunting lost arrows. Okay, I think that was the first arrow, maybe. We're cold, we're thirsty, but we're on a mission. I've never felt so cold in my life. Yes, chat, we did it. Victorious. Okay, uh, where can we put this fire to get double duty? Let's put it right here in the back, maybe? Seventy-five percent Maglins. Nice. I can't believe we did it. I can't believe we did it, chat. Go ahead and get a liter of water. Still wish you could put the pan on the fire like he would normally. Okay. Let's see if we can get that last wolf and then dump this bow. Wait, where'd he go? I could have swore there was a wolf, like, right here.
Maybe it's gone? Or did I shoot it? Maybe we shot it. Looks like I made it through another night. I just saw something over here. Like an arrow, it looked like. There shouldn't be one here though. Okay, I'm just seeing things now. I think we shot that. I think we shot that wolf. That's the one I was thinking. Alright, we deserve it. There you go. Hot oh, heavy. Hey, Salami, welcome in. Added searching arrows in Frozen Lake as a game to the Olympics. Yeah, right. I feel like there should be a way to improve the arrow with spray paint to make it like more visible. Like a tracer arrow in a way. Oh, oh I was gonna say we could read, but I think we Yeah, we already read the books we have. So we need to grab the fishing book in here. And there's another fishing book already at uh Mystery Lake, I think. I thought we had meat on us, maybe not. Alright, so after this we can go <laughs> do some more beachcombing. A little, we got a little distracted, but now we're back. I might even just go grab some fuel and nah, we're we're okay. We got we got plenty of food. Good to see you. How will your heart rate be affected if you drink a glass of water? I don't know. Cheers. Like a whole glass? Not at all. I'm not drinking at all. Looks like it Ooh, went up, I guess. Oh my. I kind of held my breath when I drank water. Maybe that has something to do with it. See if we can get one more, one more torch out of this fire. All right. So we have some meats at the hut. Let's go up at uh, Jackrabbit just to loot it, and then we'll go around the back because that's not where we've been yet. Water bad for you? No way. <laughs> I try to drink, I think I said this before, about two and a half liters a day. And, uh, you know, like, I heard somewhere, like, your brain is made up of mostly water, like, a lot of your brain. And if you're dehydrated, it, like, affects your brain function, too. And it's like, if you're dehydrated, you can feel all sorts of weird and off. But yeah, drinking water is not hard. I just try to try to keep a big bottle beside me. And sip at it all day. New location. Let's not forget we have uh, a bunch of rabbit hides. Probably be cured now. Hmm. 
What's our weight? 42. Well, we got like three kilos of meat, so that's probably the reason for that. I'm just gonna carry the meat with us and then uh, <laughs> we'll just have it where we need it. Oh, fish cakes, coastal fish cakes. I was trying to remember what is in this area for recipes. The coastal fish cakes I haven't grabbed in a long time. Ooh, ooh, this decent. Handy. Nice boots. We do want leather for our gloves, but I assume our gonna, we're gonna get like, you know, leather boots and leather on the beach. So we'll just beach comb it. Oh, what's this I see? Some flour. Again, what we should do is just drop that at Jackrabbits, but I'll just carry it now and forget I have it. need clothes, do I? I guess leather, that's it. Alright, well thanks again for all the raids. Seriously, we got like so many, so many raids today. I really do appreciate it. Um, I haven't been forgotten. But no, thank you everyone. You're awesome. Uh, and if you are new to the channel and you came in on a raid, thanks for sticking around. I uh, I have over 4,000 hours in this game, and I used to just basically do ridiculous challenges, but now I'm uh, just playing vanilla interloper because I don't play that much anymore. So I'm trying to try to like remember remember how this game works at its core. Hey, hey Sky hurts. You haven't opened this game in a while. Too much kind when you're working. Yeah. Yeah, I know. Hopefully you can carve out some time because, you know, it is like, especially if it's something you enjoy, you know, um, but I am in the same boat. I have I have a hard time finding time for sure. But the TLD will be there for you when you're ready. The the long dark. That's what I just said. The TLD. The the long dark. It's like if you say my social, my sin number, it's social insurance number number. I had, a, I had a teacher in high school who was very, oh, oh, oh. I can't believe that worked. Yeah, Great Bear ain't going anywhere. In fact, next time you play, you're probably gonna have more maps and more tales and more all sorts of stuff to discover. Oh, I remember now the uh, Fire Striker, they moved it. It can spawn at like rocks, rock slide? Not behind here anymore. I held on to the luggage and didn't fall. Yeah, something worked. I don't know how that worked. I, I was almost certain I was going for a drink. Save weight that way. Eat as we go. But that's what we're doing. We're just seeing how far we can push it. Probably get some fish. Beachcombing fish is like good now. Oh, s there we are. Ooh, beautiful. Ruined. Uh, you know what? Let's literally just go grab some sticks and cook this. I think we have one torch left, so... Yeah. And the beauty of us shooting all those wolves, they're not bugging us no more. Here we go, look at this spot. Perfect spot for a fire. Boom. 
There's a boat? Yeah, I have. Wait, uh, yes, I have. It's like a boat you can walk on, and there's some luggage in the back, and like a cabin with like a steering wheel. Yeah, it's my favorite thing. Um, there's some videos out there, Roz, of someone being on the boat when the weather change happened, and they literally, the boat just disappeared. <laughs> it's pretty funny. Pretty dang funny. Oh, you know what? Let's put the, the fry pan down. Ruined, cooked. Okay, what else? And then I'm gonna put these over here so they don't get deleted somehow. on a low run, weak ice, so you ran. Yeah, they usually don't spawn on weak ice. That's kind of lame. They robbed you of that. Oh, wow. Look at this beautiful day here. All right, you know what we'll do is get more torches. Good torches, please. That's, that's what that will do. Alright, let's wander towards Misanthrope and then we'll cut into Quonset, I think. Maybe shoot a bear or a deer over there. I, if I, can drop any of this I know, we have all this meat now. What are we doing, Astrid? But yeah, let's clear, let's clear this off, and then that way, oh wow, we got all sorts of goodies. This is another fish? Nope, old man beard. Cloth. Okay. Yeah, and like, if we clean all this out, eventually we'll get a blizzard, and then it will all be back again. Yeah, this this is one of my first like I love this map maps where I stayed here. So this is this is the the full story. I spawned in on Stalker as my first attempts, and I struggled and struggled and struggled until finally I spawned here on Coastal. And I well the the run before this is Mountain Town. I spawned Mountain Town at the farm, and I lived at the farm for four days until I ran out of food, and then I died to a wolf. And then I spawned here in Coastal, and I lived for two hundred days on Stalker, and I got comfy with the map. I learned how to you know shoot the shoot the bow a bit and uh you know i was ready and then i went to interloper and i spent most of my early interlopers on this map because i'd you know forage at desolation point and, and then get to here and i'd be like this is it this is all i need why would i leave so i have a fondness for this map I think what we'll do is leave like a little, yeah, you never forget your first. The first map where you're like, okay, I actually know what I'm doing. I know where things are. What I'm gonna do is leave a bit of food. Yeah, that one. At each of these huts. Cause we, we obviously don't need it. And then like next time we're in the area, we'll just magically have food. Which map is this? Is Lurkin? So this is Coastal Highway. So Coastal Highway was like the first map I got confident with and that I, you know, explored and and survived on. Yeah, Coastal Highway. I like too how you've got access to lots of coal. There's good hunting of every kind of animal. There's like a huge open space. Like that's it. If there's clear weather, you won't get surprised by anything. Uh, so traveling around is, is easier. And again, we're, we're clearing these as much as we can so we can get respawns. Even if you just like move the stick four feet, you'll still get the respawn I, as far as I know. Got a corpsicle. I don't see a boat, but it could be, it could be, uh, you know, at desolation point maybe? I don't know if it only spawns here, but it's RNG, right? It's not going to be guaranteed every time.
<laughs> we're gonna get jumped by the bear if we're not careful. He'll be coming around soon. This is the, remember when beachcombing was like, oh, I gotta run and time it perfectly. I'm literally walking on the edge here. <laughs> move the coal trick? Yeah, if you like already have enough coal and you move the coal, then it's just like every time you go through it, it's gonna be doubled up. And you'll have, you'll have hundreds of coal in no time, more than you know what to do with. And that's when you drag it down to a hut and then just live in a hut for two weeks fishing. Boiling water and fishing. Like, if you're trying to stack days, this game will let you do that easily. Mm, I feel like I should... Okay, how about, um, how about this? We're, we're kind of tired, but why don't we walk the rest of the ice and then back to Misanthrope? And then we'll, like, stay the night there or something. Fill those jerry cans, exactly. Yeah, find find all the jerry cans in the world and try to fill them all away with fish oil. When I started playing till D, it was the Black Rock expansion error. Every other start, yeah, they do that. They must gear it so it's like when you have a new map that just launched, they give you a heavy chance to spawn there. But yeah, Black Rock was a tough interloper spawn when you don't know the map. Like you can literally spawn there and, and be like 20 feet away from a Timberwolf pack. But yeah, I do. I do really like Blackrock. I like like the the way the map is laid out. You know, there's lots of uh, different things going on to sort of keep you occupied. Uh, yeah. The only thing is, like, I wish the prison had more going on that would bring you back there. Like the mills, one thing, and the steam tunnels are great. But like the actual prison itself, it's uh, it's basically like you go there, get the vest, and leave. It'd be cool if there was like a way to get through the prison to some other spot, maybe as another pass through. Oh, these are planks. We're going to leave those. Yeah, the planks we just leave and they'll I think they might despawn, respawn. I don't know how that works, actually. Prison that boarded up door sure leads somewhere. Yeah, something like that would be cool if you bring a hatchet and then you can you can like get get like a you know like that spot in the new map zone of contamination you hatch at the the area and get through as a as a shortcut almost all right i don't know if there's a much past to this point i think this is kind of the end of the road i'll just walk a bit further but yeah i think yeah that's that's it i think Okay, let's go back to misanthrope. Misanthropies, and I see the bear. The bear is definitely gonna come into this picture soon. Yeah, but seriously, if you have a bunch of coal stockpiled here, cabin fever hits, all you do is just walk out to your hut with the coal and live there. No problem. Another bear hunt? Well, the thing is, is I don't need the bear, so I might not hunt it. <laughs> we'll see. Like, I, I could to just to clear the area, but we have our two hides. We have our guts. Like, I don't even need a third bear. And, there, and there's no way I'm making a bear bed roll. But yeah, I guess if I was closer to cooking five, we would shoot the bear and cook it up. We got a ways, though, to go. Oh, snowflakes fallen, blizzards coming. By the time we open the misanthrope door, it's probably going to be nasty. I like the bear might sent us and just come anyways. We might have to deal with them. You hunt moose and bear as I see them. Well, I, I used to do that and I will too. I'll shoot bears for fun, but like now I feel guilty because I'm not processing the meat. So it's like, okay, I'll, I got what I need out of the hides. I'll wait till I'm going to cook a bear and then I'll shoot him. Oh yeah, this is turning quick. The weather went from beautiful to... Oh, he scented me, chat. He scented me. 
I think we're gonna have to deal with the spare, probably. We'll see. Maybe not. He's going to where he first smelled me, which is not where I'm gonna be. Run, Astrid, run! Kinda wanna grab that birch sapling. The Blackrock Moose Spawn area where you could crouch under the tree. Oh, I didn't know that. There's a, there's a cheesy area. Oh, I'm surprised I didn't know about that. Honestly, the only time I was ever in Blackrock, it was from spawn, and I never got to shoot the moose, so... Or I get the uh, moose that's at Bricklayers. That's the moose I usually got. Sneaking on past the bear. Doesn't even know I'm there. Astrid, don't give a care. Yeah, no, the bear, the bear scented me from over there, and that's the line they're taking, and it just didn't see me, which is, yeah. <laughs> I feel like if you're stinky, the bear should track your movements, not the, like, last or the first smelt spot, if that makes sense. So that's what it's doing. It's same with the wolves. They, they go to where they smell you first, and usually that's nowhere near where you are by the time they get to there. So you can use that to your advantage. Yeah, who knows, maybe we'll go to Quonset and there will be a moose. And then if that's the case and we get a full moose to cook and a bear, that's like cooking five probably for us. Bear just woke up from hibernation. Yeah, he's like, wait, what? I smelled some. Uh, I, don't, I don't know what's going on. No wolf here? Usually there's a wolf guarding misanthrope. Alright. I do want to get to Quonset, and we'll clear Quonset. We'll just shoot all the wolves in the area. Like, Quonset is one of my favorite spots. I just think it's so cool because there's like a bit of danger lurking around the corner, and there's a really nice base with a workbench and an outdoor truck that you can basically sleep in if you got good clothes. Um, I'm a big fan of Quonset as a base, even though it's kind of stupid with the wolves there. All right, let's go ahead and like waste some time here. Moldy, I think it's fine. Oh, of water. Okay. Wolves are faster than bears. Yeah, the bears. They yeah, it just takes them forever to catch up. Holy work boots. Yeah, that's why people talk about cutting the bears. Like, you can drag them all over the place if you want. That's the third wool toque on this map. Oh, I forgot. I got all the flour on me, too. We'll take that to Quonset and dump it there. And that will be our, like, place on this map with the food. You know what? We don't need, we don't need the fire anymore. Ooh, a new sport vest. Wow. Mm, it can be nice in a pinch. Maybe that's what we'll do. We'll have some time to see if our clothing needs sewing. Get see if we can push it even higher. 23 warmth. Yeah, we sleep daylight. Let's go ahead. Myopia? Isn't that like a vision thing where you can't see like certain directions or something? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, the bears aren't the smartest in TLD, that's for sure. Ooh, crackers. Oh yeah, you know what, we actually grabbed another pair of underwear, we can dump those. I'll just put them down with the rest of the clothing. 
Ooh, there's that blizzard. I, I, I called it, chat. I called it. Hey, oh, Spartacus. Oh, on Saturday. 52 months. My goodness, that is amazing. Thank you, Spartacus. I hope your weekend's going good. Hope you're enjoying some of this uh, spring, springish weather. Hopefully, it's springish where you are. And thank you for the 52 months. That's absolutely incredible. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, let's get let's see if our sewing sewing situation is good or not. Oh, you know what that blizzard means? We're gonna get a refresh on all the beach combing. Oh yeah, 50% pants? We gotta, we gotta fix these, chat. All right. Prepare everything, cloth. Get it, get it full, full up here. Ooh, we actually should be breaking up the boots that we find because we have the gloves. Oh no, we'll make rabbit mitts. So we have the hat though. We gotta make sure we repair the hat. All right, one final Mackinac repair. Final, one final toque repair. The last repair, can't fail it. If it's the last one, you, it's impossible to fail. Sure, the socks, the socks need some love too. 78% socks. This reminds me of like my original loopers where everything got repaired once it hit like 90% condition. Mending two, let's go. All right, I just wanna make sure we have some cloth on us. Five. Uh, let's get a, two more. There we go. And I'm gonna go ahead and risk it for the biscuit with the dog food, even though we have all this good food to eat. Just get this it's heavy out of my inventory. Nice work, Astrid. All right, a little inventory management. Good stuff. Ten hour snooze, we've earned it. Hours later, should be morning now. Oh yeah, stuff. Just we'll remember that's there. We we have enough. It's gorgeous in the interior. Nice. Don't see much sun in the winter. Yeah, it's always always a treat when you're like finally getting some warm days. Oh no, I knew that was gonna happen. I just want to die. Go to sleep, chat. Just let's just go have another little nap. Why not? Why not? Why? Why not? <laughs> Oof! I knew that was gonna happen. I saw moldy and clicked it anyways. It's fine. It's just literally ten hours of our life. It wasn't rune. No, it was under. Okay, so meat is under seventy-five percent condition. Is a chance at food poisoning. So fish at like 50% is a little risky. Not that bad though. And that was our entire day in bed spent.
It's fine. We didn't need sun anyways, yeah. Alright, let's still go towards... Oops. Uh, yeah, let's go towards Quonset and we'll loot that area. We'll do some shooting, ruin this bow. Maybe there will be a moose, maybe there will be a bear. Another thing with Quonset too is like there's a lot of cars to use for hunting. You know, just jump into a car. After you shoot the bear or the moose. It's a good way to, you know, avoid damage. Vitamin D. It's like Astrid has to go out and utilize the sun when it's there, otherwise she gets like... What, 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 are, what are the consequences of lack of vitamin D? Is it detrimental to your health? Weak bones? Oh no, increased sprain risk? Sounds awful. Don't, don't, don't give Hinchlin any ideas. Hey, Grim, good to see you. Welcome to the Grim Gang. Yeah, that's my cat. My cat's name is Grim, and he does handshakes to any new members who join the channel. But yeah, that's uh, it's nice to have you. Welcome in. Increased sprain risk. Let's just go with that. Vitamin D deficiency equals. What's with this weather? I thought it was clear. Oh, okay, never mind. Oh, okay, at least I know where we are. What the blizzard? We just, we just did this. Oh, I'm gonna get murked by something, aren't I? We forgot to get the uh, note. Okay, let's loot this place and then we'll go to Quonset. Ooh, a potato. Hmm. Okay. 100% rainbow trout? Take. We take that. 100% and cook too. That's really cool. Vitamin C. Be gone. Hope we find some oil soon. I think there's some sometimes at Quonset, maybe? Like Double cans? Wow. This is interloper chat. We're not cheating, I swear. Care for hoodies. Let's see if we get the matches underwear spawn. That would be our fourth pair. Nope. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Painkiller as much? Alright, let's be bold with the bow in hopes that there's no critters out there. Wolf Cologne, I know. Alright, you're looking for some food? Yeah, I'm about lunchtime for me too. But thanks for hanging, we'll catch up soon. Yikes. Oh, we got our crampons on still. Sure footing. This blizzard. There are there are quite a few hammer spawns on this map too. There's like a chance we find one right here. Oh, hacksaw. Okay. Well, we're not finding a hammer, but there is a saw. Not bad. Alright, Kwanzaa. Here we go. Let's see what we got in here. Whoa. Whoa. The shelves are stocked, chat. We're like, we're going shopping at the supermarket here. We're picking up our oats, our coffee, our lamb fuel, our oil. 
our candy bars, our soup, and our matches all in one stop. That's that's pretty that's pretty good loot drop. I don't think I've seen anything like that before. Wow. A little bit of everything. One stop shop for Astrid. another lamp nice before I fill this one up I'll just make sure that we pick the best lamp is the water potable non potable oh well All right, let's go ahead and dump some stuff here. What do we put in? Let's go ahead. feathers. What am I doing? What am I doing? Harrows, yeah. Yeah, let's drop the food too. Mm hmm. Anything we can use later. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. Just did. What are you talking about? Sewing book, more food, another whetstone. Oh my goodness, this is the loot bonanza here. Whoa, 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 whoa! Hey, Laka, welcome in. Good to see you. Wants it, wants a garage, nice one. Healed sprain risk, how'd that happen? Oh, because the lamp whale got less. What? That's so funny. As the lamp whale drains, I lose sprain risk. I think uh, it's nice that we'll have another blizzard and we can refresh and go beachcomb again. But we missed the. Uh, it's like we had a blizzard and then one day passed while we were sick with food poisoning. Okay, let's go ahead and plan what we're doing with this lamp here. Let's tear this one up because the other one's better, ultimately. Drop a bunch of food. I mean, we have fifty something cattails. We don't need to be carrying all this food with us. Pills. Astrid, what are you doing? Ah. 
Okay. It's better. All right, I like it. That's a lot of snacks. Yeah. Have you dealt with an Aurora Berry? Oh, yeah, lots. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But um, we don't have any Auroras, actually. I don't remember any Auroras yet on this run, but that could be just because of my bad memory. All right, chat. Sorry, I gotta do this to you, but I'm gonna take a break here and call the stream. I gotta go get my lunch, and then I got some family stuff I gotta attend to. I'll be back on Thursday, probably, this week. I have a, I have a day off on Thursday, so I should see ya. Otherwise, next weekend, hopefully. So uh, thank you everyone for coming in. It's been awesome as always. Give me a moment and I'll see if I can find a channel to dump all you beautiful folks onto. Give me a minute here. All right, you know what? It's been like so long since we've seen Goon. I'm gonna go raid Goon TV. They're not playing TLD, they're playing Lethal Company. We were talking about this game earlier. So if you want, uh, it looks like Goon, Helga, and Twin are all there. They're a good crew. So let's go um, go visit Goon, show some love, and uh, go, on, go off and see a TLD stream if you want. Otherwise, we're gonna go check out Goon and Lethal Company. And right in time, rocks. <laughs> Just in time to raid. My end, thanks for hanging. And again, thanks for all you do. I've been having so much fun with D&D. And uh, yeah, let's go see Goon. Go see Goon and cheer on the crew. All right, love you folks. Next weekend, uh, yes, but Thursday probably too. So maybe Thursday we'll see you all. Otherwise, take care and have a good day. Bye for now. Thanks, everyone.